Hello, 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 hello. How's everybody doing today? It is Nazan here with the lean that streams and we're back tonight. Yes, I'm saying tonight. Uh, I'm trying a little something different on a Saturday just to see how it goes. I don't know if it'll stick, but we're going to give it a shot anyway. But we're playing Spirit Fair tonight. Uh, we are going to be continuing on our story. Hello, Jojo. What's going on? How are you? Uh, but yes, uh, thank you. I am. I'm, well, I'm glad I'm your favorite lean. Um, but yeah, we're going to play some Spirit Fair. Um, so I had minor crises all week. Uh, I've been fighting with it all week, trying to get the um, audio levels all renormalized because I don't know what happened, but something was going really weird with all my sources. So I think I've got it better. Hopefully it works better. Hopefully it all sounds good and we're all good to go. Um, I think I figured out what like one of my main issues were and I've made some adjustments based on that. And um, I'm really excited to see how it goes. We'll probably make some adjustments down the road, but it was like it was really weird all week. So, but we're back today. We're gonna play Spirit Fair. I'm excited because uh, this game is really getting somewhere. We have some new characters. We lost some good characters, some really good people, and it's time for us to move forward. We also lost Giovanni, our horny lion friend, which is really sad because I actually really did like him, um, but. Uh, you know, his story was a pretty quick one, but um, I think we felt like we learned a lot about him. So we'll talk more about that when we get into the game, which I won't take too long, and we're going to go into it. So let's get into it here. Let's do it. Um, I think I think I generally go over here for this one, so let's just go and do it. I love I love this this opening screen to this game. It's so beautiful. Uh, and it's so peaceful, right? Like, everything about this game is just peaceful and nice. So, uh, we are gonna go continue on our little journey here, which should be a lot of fun. Um, I can't remember where I'm at exactly. Nate Duel, what's going on with you, man? How are you? Good to see you. I hope you're doing well. Uh, welcome to my spirit boat. Hopefully it's nice and good looking for you. But, um, yeah, so let's see here. We are got some grains. And I don't exactly remember what I was doing. But I need water. 
I know that. I also got, um, oh, I'm trying to get silk. That's the thing. So I needed to get silk, and I learned that there is a particular plant you have to get to make silk, which is what these guys are for, uh, which is nice. And then, uh, yeah, so I replaced my cherry and apple trees to get them. I'm doing pretty good, but having a blast playing Helldivers 2. What is that? I don't even know what it is. I've heard so many people playing it recently, and I have no idea what that game is. Uh, which is really cool. I guess it's a multiplayer game. I did learn that. Um, so I'm always into that. So if there's anything I can catch on that, that'd be great. But uh, anyway, like I said, we replaced our, our two bigger trees or our apple and cherry tree because I got so many apples and cherries I don't even know what I'm going to do with all of them I still got my olive and pears so that's good and uh, we'll just keep those going for now it should be good uh, so there's my pears I only get three that is a really crappy um, are you guys hungry you are hungry Helldivers 2 is a third person squad based shooter that sees elite forces of Helldivers battling to win an intergalactic struggle to rid the galaxy of rising alien threats. Wow. That is a that is a mouthful, and I sounds really good. Uh, so maybe it is something I'll have to check out, because um, it sounds cool. Anyway, if I, so I've got some sheep, and I have a cow now. Um, so let's go take a look. The only thing about like games like Helldivers, uh, if it's a shooter, <laughs> uh, I'll play it with people. I will. I'm horrible at shooters. I realize once again, I'm doing something in my game project that no one's going to realize the complexity of until next year. Like if I'm going to say inventory is a component base, not no one's going to know what that means. I don't know what that means, um, but I mean, you know, it's OK. If you, if you want to challenge yourself, then this is the time to do it. Um, so, you know, don't feel bad about ever trying to do that because, you know, if it's something you're passionate about and you want to do, I say go for it. Uh, like I said, I have so many cherries. My cow likes the cherries, I guess. It's time to milk this cow. Well, if you're interested and, uh, you ever get the game, it would be an honor playing with you as a collab. Oh, I would love to do that, Nate. Uh, anytime, man. Like, uh, let me, let me check it out first. Uh, I will say off the bat, I'm horrible at shooters. Uh, I've never really, oh, there's Giovanni's little, little shanty. And now he's no longer with us. Sad. I miss him already. Lifestyles of the rich and famous. So I need to upgrade, um... I need to upgrade, and then I need to ferment something in the cellar, and then we're doing something here and this, and I'm also doing a bunch of things here. Mist cleaner. Oh, I need silk. So again, the thing I need the most of is silk, and I just need to wait for those trees to do something. So let me go ahead and ferment something. Uh, a good Charlotte song, a banger. Which one? I don't know. Uh, let's see. I'm going to do cheese. We're going to try and make some cheese or yogurt. Sometimes let's make cheese or yogurt. I'm not 100% certain. But anyway, uh, so we're going to do that. So what I need is to... Oh, Lifestyles of the Rich and Famous. Got it. Yeah, no, that's the... Uh, I, I do know that one. That's a good one. I do know Good Charlotte. But this is, this is these guys' place, and I'm invading their home. But, you know, I've got them some nice stuff already. I hope they're appreciative. But anyway, yeah, so the big issue here is we are going to have to wait for these trees to grow a little bit. So I should probably do some, like, cooking or something. And get some food on this place. What do I have here? I got rice. I got rice flour. I don't have a lot of it, but I do have wheat flour. A lot of wheat flour. So I could do some with that. Let's do, like, five of these. And then I could make it with glue because that seems like a good idea. Um, we could do... I got a lot of milk, which is great. I could do fried with cheese, maybe? Uh, no, that's not enough. Let's do wheat and milk. What would that do, do you think? It's probably just bread. But we could do that. Let's try it. We'll do, like, cooking that. Get those things going. I don't know what it's going to be. It's going to be some sort of, like, dessert type thing, which is good because of Stanley. 
Uh, it's pretty advanced, but basically it means I can have one inventory system and attach it to any, like, players uh, and enemies, and those can be changed separately. Interesting. Well, uh, I mean, again, it sounds like a cool idea, and if it is something that you're, you know, excited to do, I don't see a problem with it. So, keep at it, is what I say. Um, okay, so it is morning, so I think we're gonna go try and get some ectoplasm. Uh, ooh, I could stop by you. I've got Slate with you. I don't know. Well, let's do that because, um, I could put something else on her back once I get the Slate. Which is a weird sentence to say. Alright! Time to feed, everyone! Time to feed. Let me just... Oh, oh, oh. I almost drowned. I can't get these. Why can't I get these? Come on. No. Okay, there we go. Alright, everyone... Did I... Did I do... The, why is there somebody up there? Somebody wants something? Oh, it's Ingrid. I... I don't know how to feel. Should I be sad? Mm -hmm. Should I be happy? Angry? I can feel his absence. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, it's as if something had been fulfilled. Completed. You know what I mean, Munchkin? Mm -hmm. Am I a bad person? Is it okay for someone to feel liberated under such circumstances? I'm sorry, Stella. I don't want to sound ungrateful. Mm -hmm. I'm still a bit shaken, but not lost. At least you're here with me. Mm -hmm. Okay, so if you don't remember the last episode, uh, we said goodbye to Giovanni, who was Ingrid's husband. Um, and the thing was, is Giovanni was kind of a lying, cheating bastard. He was really cool, but he just like, he was, he was kind of a bastard. What we learned is, um, that Stella in her life knew Giovanni and saw him die, but also based on what I was seeing might have been one of his, uh, one of his, uh, extramarital affairs. So it seems like Stella actually was with Giovanni and like loved him and like that was kind of the end of the the lion story is that him telling him like how much he is going to miss us and how much he loved us and all that kind of stuff and it was really sad um but uh you know I mean obviously no one's perfect um and people do really bad things sometimes but I guess like this game is telling you like yeah that that's true but that doesn't necessarily make him a bad person. And I, I can agree with that. Like, he's not necessarily a horrible person. He did horrible things, and he should definitely have respected Ingrid a lot more than he did. Um, but, you know, I think he was trying in his own way. And he also had reasons for doing what he did, right? So, I mean, not necessarily good reasons, but I think, like, he had a lot of, like, built-up trauma from, like, the war that he was in, because it sounds like he was in some war. I'm not sure which one. Um, but, yeah, you know, it's a very complicated storyline, right? Like, this game has some very complicated themes, um, and it does it in such a sweet, kindly way that it's really hard to, like, get wrap your head around all of it. Uh, so it looks like I'm going to need... I don't really need a lot there. Maybe some maple logs. We could do that. Uh, looks like I'm pretty good there. So we'll probably do maple logs and maybe like a couple of these. Because uh, I'm pretty pretty even on a lot of these things. I, remember remember a few episodes ago where I was like, I, gotta, I cannot find ash trees at all. And like now I've got that's the one I have the most of. So that's cool. We'll do another one of those, and yeah, we'll do another one of those, and then I will do, like, let's see, I've got 20 uh, aluminum, or I can do zinc. I'm going to do the aluminum for now. That should keep it. Stella. Stella. I forgot to do your voice, Stella. Are you not done there? All right. I'll see you later, then. Kitty! Kitty, get off of there! Kitty! Kitty, Kitty! Okay, good. <laughs> I thought Kitty was about to get sucked under the ocean right there. That would have been kind of a sad moment. Um, so, I think with that story complete, though, I'm gonna get the feeling that... Um, I kind of get the feeling that... Ingrid might be next. 
and or like the next one to leave us or something of that nature so we're gonna give you that thank you munchkin i'm actually i forgot i'm not gonna do that uh all the time <laughs> Good. I needed that. Yes, you did. Okay, so uh, yeah, so let's go make sure everybody's well fed, but I also gotta make sure that we're going somewhere. There's Stanley. Like Stanley. I do like Stanley. I'm worried about Stanley, because like that one has potential to be an incredibly sad story, if that's what it is. So, if I want ectoplasm, what is it again? Is it these? No. It's something with Stanley. I know that. So I should probably do these because I probably don't have a lot of like Comet stuff. So we're going to head towards there. And then let me just make sure everybody's fed. Stella. Stella. I don't have any bad dreams here. I think I'm even dreaming. It's all black when I close my eyes at night. And when I wake up, I can only think of one thing. Your big hat. And your face. Smiling at me. I didn't take, I didn't like to go to sleep, but I do now because I'll wake up and you'll be there. Oh, Stanley's so cute. He is so cute. Uh, he likes desserts and some, but doesn't like fruit, so I can't give him that. And he doesn't, he wouldn't like that, so maybe cake? <laughs> Dessert time again. This is incredible. I'm so happy. Thank you so much, big hat. All right, let's hug. Oh, he is so adorable. But the thing is, is that most of the other people in the ship, we could like pretty, like, uh, pretty easily like determine that they were, um, they were, what, what? Mm -hmm. I don't know why, but I'm thinking about a lot of past these days. All those images come back to me, working me up at night. I think of all the horrors during the war, mm -hmm. all my friends who died, and the joy of liberation. Mm -hmm. And of course, I think of those children we hid in the basement of the factory. Gra Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, God. No, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I don't know why, but okay, let me try and get back to this. Waking me up at night. I think of the horse mm -hmm. during the war, all my friends who died, the joy, and then, of course, I, I think of all those children that we hid in the basement of the factory, Granny Sue and I. I was so young and only a few years older than them. 16, 17. Mm -hmm. I didn't realize that what I was doing, all the implications, all the risks. Mm -hmm. But I was young and didn't see any other options. I couldn't leave those kids out there. They were so afraid, mm -hmm. so small, and we knew most of their parents. Mm -hmm. None of them came back. Oh. I can't. I think, I mean, I, 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 I'm not, like, breaking any new ground when I say that war sucks. Like, obviously war sucks. And, like, uh -huh. man, it's such a weird thing to me that human beings, um, that's how we settle our differences uh, at, at high scales is through things like war. It just feels so dumb. I don't know. I guess that's, it's a lot to think about. Hold on, I gotta go. I'll be back. I gotta go get this box. Look what I drew. I want to look at what you drew, but I gotta get this box. I knew that was gonna be here. Whoa. That is really loud. Okay. That's good to know. Interesting. Okay, so we have this at... Minus two. So maybe what I should do. And so that would put it at around. Like we did like an eight. That would put it around ten. Let's go like nine. Let's try this. Okay, we'll do that. I just want to, I'm trying, I might have to make some adjustments on that, but, um, yeah, so, like, the, the, I just feel like war, I don't know, it feels like a, it feels like a loss to me, like, every time I talk, I think about it, but it's, it's, uh, it, you know, humans do some really strange shit, I'll say that, uh, the way that we handle things, it's hard for, ooh, those are almost done growing, I like that, okay, so what do we got here, what do we got? When I make this stuff, crips. I get crips. All right, that's cool. The 
Listen to how beautiful that is. Oh, I can do this thing here. Hold on. Oh, it's too late. Okay. Wait, no. I can do this, right? Wait. Am I still moving? Is that the thing? No. Oh, it's not this one. It's way up here. Yes, let's do it. Whoa! Okay, I forgot how to do this. Yee. Aha, that's a lot of uh, shooting stars. Yep, get that chicken. Okay, so Comet Rock is probably a good thing for me to get, because I didn't have a ton of it before. Or at least I don't remember having a ton of it before, but... Maybe I do. I probably have a lot of it now. Plus, it gives you a lot of glims. A lot of it. And I do need more glims. Oh, I don't know why I went that far down, but okay. I think that was the end of that. Interesting how loud that got, though. I guess I wasn't playing when I was doing my adjustments. I didn't really, like, plan for the super loudness. Okay, uh, let's head up here, get my cheese or yogurt or whatever it actually is. I'm not 100% sure, but we're going to find out. <laughs> yogurt! I did it. I made this thing for Stanley. I did make it for Stanley, and he gets his thing for it. So, yeah, that's good. Oh, that's as far as it goes. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, that's uh, that's going to be interesting. Okay. So, um, yeah. Okay. Stanley, what's up? Big hat. <laughs> it was so boring. Nah, I almost slept the whole time. Hey, uh, I have an idea. Something will turn that around. I want to do a play. A theater play for everybody aboard. I have a story I want to tell. It's going to be great. So, um, we got to invite your favorite friends. Uh, you can decide how many people you want. Find the best audience to, for my great play. Okay. Well, good times. Let's do it. Okay, so have I fed you guys? I don't think I have. They like uh, pub food or like something fancy. I don't know if I, do I have pub food anywhere? I do, I got surf and turf. I don't know if that's what they want right now, but I do have it. Um. Let's do grilled fish might be. No, they don't like smaller plain. Uh, they don't like one ingredient things. So finding them things I really want is hard. Uh, we could do wanton soup, but I don't know. This is tough. I'll give them this. Unless they were, unless that's the last thing I gave them, which I could be. What are you trying to pull? Mickey, I eat allergic to crawfish. 
Are you trying to take the shot at the king? Nope, I am not. I just want to feed you too. I'm really just trying to feed you, I promise. Um, I don't know what to give them. <laughs> I may be out of things that I could give them. I guess maybe, may, well, would the crips work? Because they are regular dessert. Maybe they'd like that. I don't know. Free grub, the finally. The Streams is proud to support an ongoing donation drive right here on Twitch for the Lemur Conservation Foundation. I sure did. If you want to support the stream in an awesome way and can afford it, check it out. To learn more, check out the link in chat at thelemurreserve.org. Okay. Um, so with that being done, I think that's all the people we need to feed. It is nighttime, so I don't know, but I should check. I'm just really trying to stall for time so I can get my silk, which apparently comes from these guys, but they just need time to grow. And hopefully I can get a bunch of it because I really need it. Um, I don't have a lot of people, so I guess I probably could just invite everybody to Stanley's play, right? I don't see why not. Get off my fishing place. I don't see why I wouldn't invite all of them. You know what I mean? I don't really know. Let's do a little fishing. And see what we got. Yay, I got a Mai Mai. Okay, that's a good fish. I do need more than... I didn't mean to do it again, but that's okay. We'll do another one. I got to get through the night, and then I'm going to go do some uh, farming after this. I learned a good trick with this part of the game. So you do have to hold it to do the major reeling. But what you got to do is um, when... When it turns red, you don't want to stop. You just need to start tapping the button. And then that, like, makes it so it keeps, like, at least keeps you somewhat where you were. Because uh, if you if you let go, it's going to, like, let the fish run away. Or at least get further away from you. Which you don't necessarily want. So, that is bad. Okay, let's see. We got some wet. I need corn. I realized that I need corn and I need, um... I need sugar. I don't think I got a lot of sugar. Well, I might have sugar, but I don't... I'm, I haven't made it yet. I've got to take the... Um, I got to take the sugar cane and smash it, I think. Smashy, smashy. Yes, that's it. We got to smashy, smashy it is what I got to do. Either way, let's go check on my potatoes. And, oh man, I really wish my silk would grow. I, it's actually mulberry... <laughs> But I learned that that is, um, I think Cruxius and Chad actually told us that's where they come from, is sometimes, like not all the time, but sometimes a byproduct of it is silk, which I'm hoping is often now because I'm going to need as much of it as I can get. Let's grow some potatoes. The potatoes are kind of important right now. And we'll do some lettuce or cabbage or whatever that is. Um, yeah, but I think that, like, I was just talking about this earlier, though, like, um, with Stella. So it looks like, you know, Stella is uh, a person in a lot of these people's lives that knew her, right? So it's one of those really interesting things where, like, yeah, she's not perfect. And she did things, uh, at least to our knowledge, anchovy. Small fish, medium fish will do anything for love cephalopod let's do whatever this is with something else uh we could do with garlic i haven't really done anything with garlic we could do like garlic fish that might be a good combo we'll see uh i also need um, 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 um stuff but where are we at here we're still at night i do need i just need silk i really just need a shit ton of silk and they're still not growing the silk or anything of that nature. How's my cow doing? 
Let's find out. Hello, cow. You're ready to get milked again, aren't you? You're not hungry, but I can milk you. But anyway, like Stella knew Giovanni, and I think we're discovering a little bit more about her life. And so what I was saying is that I think she was in healthcare to some degree. I don't know if she was like a nurse or like some sort of like life advocate or, or something like that. Um, and that's how she knows all these people. I mean, obviously the exceptions being like Gwen, who was her friend, and then Artul, who was her uncle. Obviously those are a little different um, in scope. But they all kind of knew each other, which is really cool. Um, and I think this game is really, like, really heart-wrenching. Like, it really is. We need to do something with this. And I'm not 100% certain what. Now, let me go check my, my stuff. Okay, so... I need to play for Stanley. Invite your favorite friends. I think I could just invite everybody. Um, I would, I would definitely bring you, Gustav. I need to build your farm home. And then I still need to do your thing, but I think everything still requires silk. It's ready. <gasps> oh my God. Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay. Interesting. So I wonder if the, 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 the setup there is I have to catch them before it goes to Mulberry. And if I do that, then we'll get the silk fibers. Bullia bays. That's what garlic and... Okay. I wasn't expecting that, but fair enough. Uh, I could cook some glue. I got some sauerkraut. I guess I can cook that. What is uh what does sauerkraut do? Let me let me try this. So let me just do three sauerkraut and then I can cook it with pretty much just the pork, I guess. Alright, we'll do that. Cook. Nope, 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 nope. That's not what I was doing. Sorry, sometimes I, I mix up the buttons in this game. It is a little bit like counterintuitive, the game uh, buttons. But let me try that again. So it's three of those and three of those and cook. That's what I want. So sauerkraut and pork or and pork chops. We'll see. Okay, so with all that being said, I can now make some silk um, and I can go somewhere. And let me see where I want to go because I wanted to go. I don't know what I want to do, actually. What is over here? I still need a bunch of stuff. So let me try and do this. Um... And we'll just stop by you along the way because that gives me some other things. So wait, not you. Hold on. No, no, no. I don't want that one, even though you are there. I want what's down here. Zinc? No, we're fine there. Uh, what about this sister up in the northern zone? You. I don't really need that stuff, but okay, we'll go to you. Anyway. While we're doing that, uh, I'm going to go try and make some silk and see if we can do some of these things. Hey, Gustav, what's going on? Wait, no, where are you going? I need to talk to you. Goosey, goosey. Oh, you are starving. Why are you starving? Didn't I not just... Oh, I forgot because I stopped by a box and I had to do that first, so that didn't work. Okay, um, I'm going to do uh, mm, wanton soup. He might really like that. Oh, I must have given that to him last time. I didn't realize that. So we'll give him uh, some paella. Mm. Yes. I love how happy he gets. Mm. He, and then he sips it. He just puts it in a cup and he's like, that's my favorite. Um. Uh -huh. mm. Hmm. Well, good. Let's not make this a habit, so shall we? Yesterday, my computer froze. Did my it? own fault, though. I left too many windows open. <laughs> Nice. Well, that'll do it. That will do it. Okay, so I'm going to make... That'll do it. Good one. Good one, Torch. I like it. Why did we stop? Oh, because of uh, lightning. Um, I'm going to hold off on that, but I need to make some silk fiber. So we're going to say no to this. I wish you didn't have to always say no. Like, I wish you could just, like... Or at least it would give you the option to do it from wherever you are. 
All right, silk, 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 silk. I can do copper for some reason and a green onion. Okay, silk. We're going to make silk. We're just going to make all of it. And, well, I'm just going to do all of it. And we're going to loom this shit. Okay, that gives me quite a bit of silk. That gives me silk thread, but what do I need? I forgot what I need. So let me go check on some things. What? No, not again. <laughs> Just like, oh, also again, by the way. Uh, okay, so I know you guys needed something that required silk. Yes, yeah, silk fabric. And so if I get the fabric made... I'll be able to finish this off. Okay, so that'll be good, because he's been bitching about that for a while now. How you doing, Do uh, Torch? I hope you're having a good day. Uh, welcome, welcome, welcome. Wool, wool, wool. Nebula, nebula. Silk thread. So let's make, as, let's make like, um, let's leave like five of these in here, and then we'll just weave. What? Does, oh, I must have missed or something? Okay, so that should give me enough silk fabric to do that stuff with. We'll see though. Uh, let me try this though now. Okay, let's go see if I've got enough silk fabric to do it. Uh, I need to say no to this because I don't want to do it right now. So that's good. Okay, so I should be able to do this now. Do I need to do anything here? No. Okay. Let's do it. Bam! You got your little whiskey table. That's good. Okay, so they're all done. They are all done. Okay. Good. And it looks like I might have some more... No, I have nothing there. But I got my um, olives, right? Those are all ready to go. I don't really need those right now, but I got something cooking. That takes a long time. I forgot what I put in there. Oh, right. The sauerkraut and pork. Got it. Okay. So, I did that. I got them what they wanted. And then, now, let Estrid live her best life. Wait, what am I doing? One of six, huh? Okay. Play. I gotta talk to people uh, and get that. And then I need to get a vintage modern desk. Oh, how do... Maybe that's something I also needed silk for. I can't remember. I did need silk thread. I have a, a not enough of that. I need silver ingot and ash plank. And I should be able to get the silk thread. So let's make some ingots and then um, that. And then there's also, I need a bunch of other things. But we'll get to that in a second. Because I do need that mist clearer thing. So let's make some silver ingots. Silver, silver, silver. There you go. Let's, nope. God damn it. Okay, finalize. I don't remember how silk goes, but let's see. Or silver. Oh, it's over there. Okay, I see. It's not too bad. It's a little bit... Ugh. Oh, my God. I thought it was going to... It failed me. God damn it. Ugh. See, the thing is that this one is very sensitive. So that's the issue here. Is that this one is weird because I kind of have to, like... Be very uh, see it goes way too far, and then that fails it. I forgot silver is sensitive. 
Maybe that's like an allusion or like an allusion to like how silver actually is. I don't know. I, I can't remember how to do this one because like to get it in the right zone. They, oh, I see. So if you go over, that's bad. It's not necessarily bad to go to the colder zone unless you probably go too far. So maybe that's the strategy. I just have to make sure that I do it from probably right around that spot, right? Like right there. That's even almost too far. Right there, maybe. But that was a good one. Nope, nope, damn it. Ah, oh, fuck, I went too, I, was, I panicked. I panicked because I thought I was almost there and I panicked and now I screwed myself. I'm doing so bad on silver. I am not a silversmith, apparently. Okay, so I gotta wait till it gets to be about right there. Is that too much? That might be too much. Okay, maybe right there. That's perfect, okay. We are running into lightning basically constantly at this point. <laughs> that was it. Wait, no, you're done. That that has to have counted. Come on now. You cannot. You cannot do that to me. All right, whatever. Give me that. It's all good. Let me get out of here. My sheepies are probably hungry. Okay, so I made sauerkraut and pork chops. That made sauerkraut meal. I'm sure that's delicious. I don't want to do that. Okay, so I think with that, I needed maple logs or something like that. Or I would have to go double check, but no. Just stop asking. At least for a little while. Let me let me have my peace to do whatever it is that I'm doing. It was cold outside. It was cold here, too, by the way, Torch. It was snowing all day. It was very beautiful, though. I really enjoyed just how beautiful it was. Okay. So, um, let's go check what I need, because I know I needed something for Goosty. Gustav. And I still need to talk to everybody so I can get, um, so I can start inviting them to... Stanley's show. It is raining everywhere now. Is it like moved all the raining spots? Like it feels like it moved everything. Okay, so I've got silver. I need silk. I need ash planks because I'm short two ash planks for this. That's insanity. Okay, hold on. Let's just go get those. Oh, box. Bloop. Nope. How are you doing, Goosty? You're good. Oh, wait. I want Goosty to go to the show. Hold on. Uh, an experimental theory after peace. Tonight, what a treat. Yes. Perfectly experimental by a young child. Okay. Uh, it was... Oh, it was ash blanks. I need ash. So let's make... Let's make, like, several of these. Let's make, like, ten of these so I have more later. And then, um... That way I don't run out as all of them. These ones are a little tougher because I think they, they jump around a little bit more on ash than some of the other logs, but that's okay. I learned I can use uh, use this stuff to make uh, paper, right? Something like that. Or the, 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 the uh, sawdust can be used, used to make paper. Missed one? Missed one what? I don't know what I missed. Yep. Oh, outside in the water? I might have. I wasn't paying super close. I wasn't even like planning on stopping there, so that's okay. I got I got more important things to saw and such, you know? Can't get them all, I guess. Uh, okay, so I've got you going. Uh, I think I'm going to bring Ingrid with me. What was that? All right. Uh, it was probably the rocks or ice or something. Let's bring Ingrid 
Um, mm -hmm. That sounds wonderful. That's something where my husband would never like to go. Well, I don't know if that's a good thing. Scout, get in here. Hey. Mickey loves it. It's exactly up his alley. Don't tell him this, but he wanted upstage Romeo. You wouldn't know him, but he's a guy from the South Shore. He's a, a got expensive taste. He has an awful mansion. He would uh, boast around town uh, about his house. Mickey hated him. Listen, you've been doing enough of ru running around here. You should get somewhere else. Take out and take or take you out and relax a bit. Uh, let me ask Mickey, and uh, we'll think of something. Well, that's cool. They're gonna take me out for like dinner or something. That'll be cool. Okay, so I think we're at the big hat. I got a great idea. Um, uh, now that you found some volunteers, we just need to find a place for the play. Uh, I was thinking that big city in Oxbury. Uh, all those lights, all those buildings. It would be awesome. Okay, that's fine. I am down with that. Be a dear. Mm-hmm. You wouldn't happen to have a little something to eat, would you? You're hungry, are you? Well, I could give you something. You like simple things? I'll give you some popcorn. Thank you, Munchkin. Ow. Did I invite... Yes, I did. Okay. I mean, I guess I should invite Mickey and them, too, because, like, who else am I going to invite? <laughs> um, I should bring everybody. I'll bring everybody. I don't really have anybody else anyway, so... Also, I need to see, like, what I need for um, that one character, the new character's um, house. I need to do something with that, I think. So, we'll get that here in a second. Uh, what is with that? Why is that tree shining? You see that? What is going on with that tree? The tree's magical. It's a magic tree. Hopefully it has magic properties that I can use. Like, ma whoop, there it goes. Okay, maple. It was just maple. All right, so let me see. What else do I need then? Because I'm not super short on a lot of things. Uh, let's do zinc or silver. I could do more aluminum here. So we'll add that and finalize. And then you... Am I low on anything else? Not super low. We could do maple, though. Uh, we'll add you, finalize, and then I'll probably do some zinc. It's a good way to get your stuff. Stella. Stella. I'm coming. I'm trying. I'm really trying really hard here. I just missed completely. It was really bad. Okay, you're good to go. You took your sweet time, right? Are you done? Yep. All right. I'll see you later then. Okay, bye. All right, it is sleep time. So I've got a minute to kind of collect everything. Um, let me see what we needed here. So I think for Goosty... I might have everything I need except for more silk thread, which I would need to, I need to go check on these things. They're not ready yet. Okay, that's fine. So I think with Goosty, we're pretty much where we need to be. Uh, let me check on that farmhouse situation. Stanley's playroom. Okay. Um, Beverly's farm. I can actually build Beverly's farmhouse right now. So that actually could be a good thing to do. I think that's okay. So let's go ahead and do that. And we'll put her up above Ingi's place. Right there. And that should get her back on board, right? So I think that does the trick there. And then let's see. Is there anything else I can put together? I've been meaning to do these at some point, but so far I haven't really needed them. Pretty pretty much got everything here except for a chicken coop, and I can't afford those. I could if I wanted to, but I'm not like... A chicken coop might be a good idea. 
we might do that. So let me get some wool fabric going and some, it said, what was it? Copper? Copper, I think. Because that might be a good thing to get. Okay, so copper and wool. Got it. Okay, so I need to do copper. Oh, I need to plant or I need to water real quick. So once we get enough silk, um, and then the other thing was uh, the ship upgrade, but I'm going to hold off on that until I get some of these other things done. And uh, that should be really good at that point. So I've got some cotton thread, linen thread, wool thread. That's what they wanted was wool fabric. So I think if I just do like 10 of these, that should be good. I have so much wool fabric. And that's just because I was like cutting those sheep like every 10 minutes. And I didn't really need to do that, but that's okay. Damn it. Okay. So so with that, uh, we can go make my copper. Which I think that one I'm going to have to do twice. I should check out my cow while I'm up here. Yep, cow is up. Cow is up. Probably feeling a little utterly full. <laughs> Get it? I'm going to milk you, is what I'm saying. See you later. All right. Cow is good. Let's make my copy. Yoink. Okay. So we're going to do like two sets of these. Because I think I need more than five to do this. And if I remember, copper wasn't as difficult as silver. So that's fine. I think there is a... Um, I could probably upgrade some of these things. Like, it might be cool if I could get more of this stuff <laughs> um, every time I do it. But I'm not like... Oh, come on. Oh, that was way too much. Why did I do that? I'm an idiot. Okay, it's still fine. They, they're giving me some forgiveness there. That's nice being forgiving. I don't know why I went so crazy with that. Okay, that did that. So we're going to do one more set there and then we should have enough copper to make a chicken coop. I think that's what this is for, right? What's one of those? I'm pretty sure this is the copper portion. Or I'm pretty sure this is chicken coop materials, which is kind of what we're going for. But I think if I have, like, you know, my cows, my chickens, that'll give me eggs, I assume, is the plan. And I haven't really fed anybody in a while. God, why do I, why am I so eager to, like, push this? Um, I haven't fed anyone in a while, so I'm probably going to have to feed some people. And I need to go invite, what's their names, to Stanley's play. Oh, God, why, I did it again. I just run over there and push the button. And I don't need to. There's no reason to do that. Okay. Get impatient. Because I want a chicken coop so bad. You know, I just really want a chicken coop. I heard something. Was that the kitchen? How are you guys doing, by the way? Oh, you're starving. It's a good thing I have you guys in the... Uh, the keep the holders now. Because the problem with you guys is that if you're not in the holders and you get hungry, you go eat my other crops. Oop. Oh, those are done. I gotta go do that. Uh, let me go uh, feed uh, you real quick, and then we'll just uh, go get my silk things. And then I should be able to finish Gustav's house. Or at least get him the desk he wants. I don't even want the mulberry, like, at all. Like, I've been, like, not doing any of that. Um, Silk, 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 silk. Where's silk, 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 silk fiber? Okay. I'm going to do like 10 of these. Because I know I... That's all I got. That's okay. That's good. We'll do it this way. Um, we'll just do the... the These. Hello, Gustav. Thanks for walking right in my field of view. Appreciate it. I'm only doing this for you, buddy. Okay, so that gives me like 20 of those. Good morning. You're not hungry. Um, okay, I gotta wake everybody up. It is morning time. 
And let's build some things. So first things first is I'm going to do Gustav's things. I think that was it there. So that should do that. And he's got his new desk, which should be great. Um, and I think that's that. And then uh, from here, I should be able to build my chicken coop. I don't know if I need to go find chickens um, or anything like that. What is he doing way the frick up there? Hi, buddy. How are you? You doing good up there? Good Lord. Okay. Listen, only the cool kids join okay, the chicken coop. on Discord. So that thing's I can see huge. why you are not there. Just saying. Holy shit. That thing's freaking huge. Um, That's a problem because I don't know if I have anywhere to put you. I think I could do this if... I put it... Crap. Okay. Um, let me edit this, I guess. If I put you... Over here on top of this shanty... That might give me the space to do this. Okay. Really? Oh, it's because of that little nook right there. Crap. Why do they got to make this so difficult? Because of whatever that is, those little, like, things. And, 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 and the, uh, I could put it over here, but I don't want to, like, disrupt the flow of my system. Oh, well. I don't know if I have much of a choice right now. Okay, chicken coop next to that place. I got a little farmhouse next to a chicken coop. So that's good. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Mickey had an idea. All right. Well, I need to talk to you about something else, though. Apparently, there's this place called Greymist Peaks. It shouldn't be far from here. Mickey thinks you're, well, we both think you're doing a decent job. Listen, we've been asking a lot from you. Consider this our treat. A little camping trip for your efforts. Some recognition for your discretion in our affairs. We never really actually been camping, but we would uh, do this as a gift for you. Let's take a look at some rocks and trees and shit. <laughs> Fair enough. I'm all for it. Okay, somebody wanted something. Good morning. Oh, Gusta, I missed. How are you doing there, buddy? It's finally here. Look at it. Look at the curves. Look at the perfect fit of the materials. Truly a masterpiece. I'll be able to accomplish my immense work much more comfortably and glamorously. Now, I can manage most of the smaller pieces myself, but the larger ones, as this desk, will be manufactured ourselves. Once I have received the same designs from collaborators, I'll give them over to you. Um. I'm sure you'll be, as usual, perfectly competent in executing them. I suppose the search for Eric Deskman. Look. Okay, I didn't mean to go into the house. You said look. All right, no, let me go talk to um, these guys and invite them to Stanley's play. Of course, they're going to go all the way up here. What is this? Why am I getting the sound? It's such a blast. Uh, Mickey making so much money. The money. There was nothing we could buy. Our mom had never seen so much dough. She was a great lady. Stuck in our old ways. She knew Mickey put herself in danger, but she didn't say anything since the house was paid twice over. All right. Can I just talk to you? I just, you want food. I'll give you some food, and then I want you to talk to me because I think I want to invite you to Stanley's thing. Uh, do you like crepes? What about this? You might like sauerkraut meal. Free grub, finally. Okay. Oh, I can't talk to you. Why not? Okay, I guess I can't. Um, Stanley, come here. You're probably starving, buddy. Stanley, you're a growing boy, potentially. Maybe, I don't know. You want some food? You like breakfast, right? You like breakfast? I got apple pie, but he doesn't like that. Uh, best breakfast to stay in shape. It's very healthy. Preps, maybe. That'll be good. Dessert time again. This is incredible. Okay. So that should do that. We've done quite a bit here. I need to go pick somebody up, right? So I need to go get head to Oxbury. 
Um, Astrid, leave Astrid to her best life. Maybe I should give her, she's dealing with a lot. I know, I know, but I just want to give you food. Because you still want to eat, I assume. Um, do you want some, like, um, the, the, the things with the things? I know she likes simple things, so I gotta be, like, very... Maybe, like, some fried crawfish. That'll work. Okay, she's good. So that should be everybody. Um, and I don't remember what else I needed. I know I needed um, something. I'm going camping. I got pretty much everybody. Wait for Gustav to give you more designs for his exhibit. Uh, head to Oxbury. I got to go pick her up. And then from here, I still need more silk fabric. I need bottled ectoplasm and crystal glass sheet. And I need one more spirit flower. Okay, so I've got pretty much everything I need. Um, and I've also got enough money to buy bigger ship if I want to, but I'm not sure I want to yet. But I should go somewhere. Where am I right now? I'm still here. Got it. Okay. So, where do I get ectoplasm from? I don't even know. I think I, I know I get it from Stanley's like little bug friend. Maybe I just have to go to the bug friend and do that. I don't even know. Maybe I'll just try it and see what it does. Can't hurt, I guess. I need to go do some things. So let me do this and get try and get some ectoplasm. And then uh, let's see what this does. Start the event. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, okay. Wait, I'm still inside. Why am I... Okay, hold on. Wait, hold on. Nope, come here. God, these guys are so fast. Um, this is the only thing about this thing, is that these guys are not easy to get. Because they... Some of these guys are just so fast. No, get over here! You are so fast. Oh my god. See, they move so well. And I do not. <laughs> What am I doing right now? I got like two of them. Where are they? Oh, there's one right there, but they just are so quick. How do I get them? There's got to be a better way. How did that not get them? All right, whatever. I got... Well, I got enough. That's all I needed. That's fine. <laughs> Those are hard. Um, okay, so let's do this. We got... The, what is this? What do I have in here? I got a flow flow, spirit flower, and an oval. Okay, but I've also got that map they just gave me. Where did they what did they do with that map? Unless it's just on my I don't need this. Unless it's just on here. And, like, I should be able to find it. But I need to go to Oxbury. I do know that. So we're going to go to Oxbury. Uh, that needs to... Where is the quickest way to do this? Mm, okay, so we'll just go here. All right, let me get this corn. Okay. Um. I don't know what that is. Okay. Um. Anyway, let me just get these. So we're going to go to Oxbury, and then we're going to do some of the missions there. I think also I need to go camping with the boys over here. All right, let me go do my thing. Ba-da-ba-da-ba-da. -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. 
Yes, we have to travel. Oxbury is a long ways away. This is Oxbury, right? Yes. So we're going to go here. I love him. He's so amazing. He's just so he's just this like crazy ball of energy, it seems like. And that's why he's able to make you like go places is because he's just a ball of energy, which is neat. You can't fault this game for character design. They've done such an amazing job with that. All right, let's get some things replanted. Um, I'm going to do more corn. Uh, I think we'll just do the three mains right now. Wheat and sugarcane. But I feel like we're really moving now. I do. I feel like we're really moving. Okay. Uh, did I water all these? I don't know if I did. I, d I definitely did that one, but I didn't do the other one. I can tell. Because the you can tell by the color of the like the dirt. Okay, so we're in Oxbury. Let me go check on some other things before I go into town. Let's get my thoughts. This should get me the new spirit lady who may give me another oval, which may be allow me to um, get another. I don't know where I would go for that, though, but I think that this would give me another like ability, which should help me in other places, which is never a bad thing because you want to do as many of those as you can. I'll do another patat because I want to make sure I have plenty of potatoes, which I do have quite a few now. And then, like, I think what we're going to try and do is get try to finish this game with like or at least get somewhere in this game where it's like oh here's a good place to end off or like some send off because i feel like we're getting close with some of these guys and i feel like we definitely must be but i better go into town before it gets too late like i think we are going to be getting close to at least ingrid and then probably um the boys once we do that um oh here we go Okay. Hey, big hat. I'm so excited. This is going to be the best. Are you ready to watch my play? Yep. Okay, get ready. This is the a girl with a big hat. She's tall, and she runs around everywhere. She does everything. What? That's the big gate. It's huge. It's shiny. There. Uh, where is it anyway? Oh, the girl knows. But when you're ready, she takes you. <laughs> Then you leave with her. It's long. Everyone else is sad. Then, boom. Intriguing. Big lights and a big rumble. Explosion. Wind. Dust. Smoke everywhere. Everything is quiet for a second. Then we don't get to see our friend again. And that's when the real pain starts. <laughs> the end. Thank you for coming. A play in one act. Okay, that was delightful. Oh, then they show the, the symbols in the background of the people we lost along the way. I'm still trying to figure out what um, Stanley's thing is because, like, I feel like... Oh, wait, hold on. Well, no, they'll probably... I, I need to go do something else because there was something else here I needed to do, right? In Oxbury? I don't remember. What was it? I needed to do um, requests. So we're going to Oxbury for Beverly. I need to talk to Beverly. Oh, there she is. Sweet pea. Oh, there you are. There you are. Um, are you here to apologize about the house? Well, don't. Uh, it's nice and all. But remember, never apologize just because someone asked you to. 
A real culprit here is Anthony. He might be a professional architect, but he's an amateur record keeper. If he thinks the house was for my family, then he must think very little of me. What a joke. He's heard the last of me. Men, who needs them? Well then, let's go aboard. I can't wait to see my house. The right one, that is. She seems very obnoxious. I'm not gonna lie. Very obnoxious, but that's okay. Uh, because, uh... That's what we want. We want her on the ship. I'm sure there's a, a very good story behind her as well, so that could be interesting. Um, but I need to see. So Stanley's probably asleep, though, which is good. He needs to be. And she's probably asleep, too, because that was supposed to be her house, but maybe someone else will occupy it because it feels like kind of a waste to have it. Unless I can, like, sell it. I don't know. Maybe I can. I should check my chicken coop. I haven't done that. I have no chickens. How do you get chickens? Oh, wait. I can put eggs in here? What does that do? I'll put one in to see what happens. I just... Oh, they turn into chickens. Oh. Nice little house here you have. Okay, so... With all that, I've got to go check on my silk. Nothing there. Did I cook anything? I have not. I should. I need to cook something for Stanley. So we'll put that in there, and then uh, we'll put some cheese. That's always delicious. Oop, my silk's ready. Okay, so now I'm going to go do the camping trip with the boys once everybody wakes up. So once I get everything going, um, better check on my sheepies and my cow pow. My cow pow. My cow pow pow is my cow pow. Um, yeah, so let is that there's supposed to be another one of you was that I must have missed you. You gotta be hungry too, right? Yeah, you are. You are. You are. You right. There you go. Enjoy some food. Why are you sleeping outside? I mean, you're perfectly welcome to do so, but that is very interesting of you. Feed. I do need to feed you. I'll give you some corn, because that's, like, pretty cow-friendly, right? I'm pretty sure cows like corn. I think that's what they feed cows. I know that. No, I do know that because when I was at, um, I was in Oregon recently. Hello, Cruxius. How are you doing? Uh, I was in Oregon recently and, uh, went to the Tillamook cheese factory, which is one of my favorite, like, cheeses, you know, for, like, commercial buys. Um, and that's what they told us. They feed them corn. So. What do I need? Do you need anything? No, I'm good there. Uh, improve. Okay. So, you don't need anything yet. You're good. Um, so full. Friends wanted a Korean barbecue. Ooh, yum. Oh, she does want stuff already. Man, she is, uh, she is, uh, now you're stuffed? Well, that would make sense. Korean barbecue is so good, though, so I can't blame you for that. Um, okay, so where am I on everything, then? I may need to do some Wawa. How goes the fairing? Pretty good. We got Silk going. We got everybody's things upgraded, except and we also got that new little chickadees um, house built and ready to go. So now she needs stuff. Uh, but it looks like I'm pretty close to, like, getting through a lot of things. I also got a chicken coop now. So I've got cows, I got sheep, and I got chickens. I don't know what else I need. I got everything I need. Um, except for ways of getting around, which might help me with the ectoplasm stuff. So I could do air draft, or I could do a zip line, and I also have enough... Uh, what is that? Oh yeah, so I've got this. I feel like some of these might be a good thing to do. I'm not sure, but we could do it. I can't see why not. Uh, so let's just go ahead and build one. And I imagine the best plan... Pick anyone new? Just the chicken lady. She finally joined the ship. 
uh, because uh, I got her house built. So that's nice. I'll put up in. A, I'm gonna put up a a zip line to somewhere. So we'll put that up at the very top here. And then that can go... Oh, shoot. I'm not going to have space for this. There we go. Like that. Something like that. That'll do some... That'll help, I'm sure. Um, and then... So then now... I should be making some flour, too. I haven't done that in a while. Omelette. Perfect. That'll be great for Stanley. Okay. So I'm hoping to get some chickies going. But I should do... Let's try this really quick. That's nice right there. Okay. Let's do this. Let's get this thing going. Um, I'm about to go on a camping trip with Mickey and team. I think that's the plan. So um, let's do this. And Stanley just did his play. Which is the two major things we've done in recent moments. But let me just see if I can find out where they where do they want to do that camping trip. I also need to get the mist thing figured out because I have that ability. But I don't remember where they wanted to do this. Maybe it's on my maybe it's on my missions. Hold on. Uh, um, um, camping. Astrid also wants some time. Okay, so head over to Grey Mist Peaks. I don't know where that is. I bet I bet that's out of range right now. Yes, it is. Okay, so I still I need to get I need to concentrate on getting the upgrade. Is what I need to concentrate on. So, right now, I need more silk fabric, and I need crystal glass sheets, and one more spirit flower. Interesting. All right, we got a, we got some interested parties over here, so let's go take a look. Ta-da! It was amazing, right? I'm sure everybody liked it. Uh, please, Stella, go ask around. But wait, wait, wait. Don't float. Don't flat out ask about it. Just... Don't make it obvious. Uh, be cool, big hat. Okay, I will do that, my friend. Wee. You're so far up here. Nice job. Oh, nice job. You really pulled out all the stops. I knew I could count on you to build me this house. Look, the it took more tries than I imagined, but that's all right. Having you around is quite the treat. My kids just don't come as often as I would like. They're busy with their own lives. I'm just not part of theirs anymore. Well, that's, uh, that's what neighbors are for. I'm glad you moved upstairs. Oh, you've always been a helping hand. And you and Daffodil are so quiet. That's what makes you such great listener. Well then, let me get settled in. This house and I need some time to reconnect. And a good night's sleep is where my old bed will do me wonders. Well, talk soon. So that just gave me something because I'm wondering now if, um, that makes me wonder now if, um, the, it, the thing is that we saw in our last division into Stella's life that she, she was moving to a new city and that could have been Oxbury. I have a chicken. Look at the little chicky. I'm going to make another one. Hell yeah. Look at you, don't, kitty, you better not eat that chicken. If you do, what is this? Oh, it's a feeder. Oh, okay. I don't know if they want coffee beans, but that seems to be the thing I have the most of. I'll give them that. That's probably good for them. We'll have some real hyperactive chickens. Um, but yeah, so... I need to figure out... Okay, so I need to concentrate on getting this. Which means I need silk fabric and I need crystal glass sheets. Um, so... Let's start with the crystal glass. 
and see what that takes. So I need silica powder and I need zinc ingots. Okay. Uh, let me go to the crusher then. Oh, you're over here. Stella, back home no one ever let me starve like this. Well, I didn't know you were hungry. I bet she likes fancy things too, right? That's going to be a problem. What do you like? I don't know. Feels bullied by Mickey. What has Mickey done to you? What is Mickey doing to you? I bet she likes tea. Oh no. I can't touch anything that's a stimulant. Sunflowers are good for them since sunflowers grow into more seeds, but they'll eat anything and make eggs. Okay, cool. I don't think I have a ton of sunflower seeds, so I might have to make more. Um, I just not like them. It's not how I like to make veal. I already have the right amount of a bev. All right. Well, that didn't work. Um, maybe some bisque. Oh, thank you. Okay, let's see what that tells me. She dislikes stimulants. Oh my god, I hate you. I actually, she might be my least favorite character. Like, she's still great. Mickey makes everyone feel upset? Probably. That's probably true. But, like, I feel like she is maybe the most annoying of all of them so far. I don't know. Okay, we'll make silk fabric, I guess. Do I have just thread already? Apparently not. Alrighty. I guess we're making it from scratch. Oh, I'm really bad there. Oh. Okay, so I got silk thread. So I could probably just make my uh, new silk. So we'll just make a bunch. Of, we'll just make like 15 of these for now. Because I do need a lot of them. Actually, I need more than that, I think. Because I think there was a lot there. So we'll just do like 22. Probably don't need to do this much of it. But I'll have it, I guess. That's always good. And it's a renewable resource now. Since I've got, you know, so many of them coming my way with the mulberry trees so that works Mahwet Mahwet is done I definitely did need to do this much this is a ridiculous amount of, of silk but I need clear gra glass sheets I need that okay um, so I need to do something here let me do this Silica, 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 silica. I can crush everything, anything I want. Okay, so let's do add, 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 crush. Let's go with the crush. Give me some crush, 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 crushy, crush, 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 crush. Seems to take a lot to make this powder. <laughs> Oh, Kadoki. I'm gonna do more of that. Did it only give me four? That doesn't feel right. But I gotta get the mist cleaner. That is the thing. The next thing we need is the mist cleaner. So if I can get that, we'll be in really good shape. Okay. All right. So let's go get my wet, which is my corn wheat. I think that's what I was concentrating on was corn wheat. Yep. Good corn flour. Sorry, not corn wheat. That doesn't even make any sense. Um, you're all... Whoop. What was I doing? Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, I need to go to the smithy. That's right. Smithy. 
Okay, so now I can do this. I'm probably going to need more zinc, but that's okay. So we're going to get started on this, and then that will start making stuff. I can't remember if it's just one-to-one. -one. Like, if I make one, that's all I get. I don't really remember. I see okay, so I gotta make this. To I don't know. That's Why fine. not just do it? Come on. Letting this go. Okay. How much did that give me? One. Hmm. All right. Well, we'll just make the three of them for now. Beautiful. So if I do one more of those, but we need to see, like, we need to get as many of these, like, I need to get this mist cleaner. I really need the mist cleaner because that's like the one thing holding me back right now. If I can do that, then I can get some of these storylines going. I get the feeling that Ingrid is probably going to be the first one to go at this point because I think her story is kind of coming to a close, um, especially after the whole Giovanni arc. Oops, I did that too hard. Um, the Giovanni arc definitely hit her. And I feel like she's heading towards, like, at least something's about to happen with her. I'm not really sure if it's, like, a storyline with her or something of that nature, but um, we'll see. Okay, so with that, what do I need? I need more glass sheets. I still don't have enough of those. And I need one more spirit flower. Interesting. What... What was I short? A zinc. It was zinc ingots, maybe? Zinc ingots? Zinc ingot. I can do that. I can do that. I still need like three of those. Damn. Zinc ingots, huh? Well, I shall do that. I'm going to water these on the way up. And then I probably have to milk my cow and go check on my chicky chicks. But I'll have eggs. I guess that's good. We'll have plenty of eggs. Okay, so I've got zinc, 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 zinc. There we go. We'll do like five of these. That should give me enough to get what we are going for. Oh, this is the one that moves up super slow. I don't know if I almost prefer that. It is a little easier to control that way. Perfect. Okay, so that should give me enough zinc to get enough crystal glass. think pretty sure 
Yes, I'm gonna have plenty. I wish this didn't take so long. It does take a long time. I feel like wheat is coming out faster. Did I upgrade? Did I upgrade it? Because they must have done something, right? Because I feel like it's coming out really fast now. do I think one more of these is what I need because that should get me to the six that's what we're going for is I'm trying to get six of them it is too dark to navigate it'll give me some what is that why is somebody want something I'm busy whoever you are I'll be up there in a minute just chill I'm working on it I need to make some zinc some glass so I can move us forward in this game Stella needs more protective equipment of specialized nature. Okay, so that should do it. Let me just double check. No, I'm still short one. And even if I do have it, um, I'm still short one spirit flower. So I've got to try and finish somebody's story. All right, one more of these. I thought we had enough. I thought we had enough. But I was incorrect in that assumption. Check on my chickadees. Yoink. Somebody up here wanted something, but I didn't see what they wanted. It was probably her being like, why am I next to a chicken coop? You guys good? I can't really do anything else, so apparently I don't have any eggs yet. They're probably too young to produce eggs, right? So I gotta let them grow. My cow is good. How's my cow? My cow. You're not hungry. Cows, you know what I'm finding is cows don't eat all that regularly. It doesn't seem like. You know what I mean? Like it feels like the cow is pretty chill when it comes to eating. <laughs> uh, maybe I should do something in here. I could do more sauerkraut or I could do yogurt. We'll do that. We'll just, well, maybe I'll do this. Um, nope. Finalize that. Get some uh, lettuce going. And then get some milk going. I'm not 100% certain if... Because I, I know... Uh, I think the animals only eat when you take product from them. I don't think that's the case. Because I feel like the, the cow hasn't... Doesn't need it right now. Um, so I think it's just timed based on whatever you get them. Is what I'm gathering. So like I know I've been giving my sheeps like like cherries and i think the problem there is that that doesn't last very long um but i think it is timed based on the type of food you give them and how filling it is 
I'm assuming that takes place with animals too, but I'm, I guess I'm not 100% certain on that. So don't, don't quote me on that. In any case, I should have enough of everything now, except for one spirit flower we are missing. So hopefully we're reaching a con I mean, I don't want to say hopefully, because that's kind of sad if that's the case. Um, potentially we are reaching the end of someone's storyline here very, very shortly. Um, which may be what we, I have so much beef. I didn't realize that. Let's do like five beef. That's a pretty good compromise. So if I do that with probably like a veggie, let's do that with like mm, that. Well, it's not enough. Um, let's do it with olives. I bet that would be good. Yeah, let's do five of those olives and steak. I don't know what that's going to be, but I'm going to go with it. Um, okay, so with that, where am I on everything? I do need, uh, I could just buy that. All right. Um, where, okay, let's take a look at request. We got the gray mist thing. Uh, Astrid, leave her be. Um, ask Gustav and Astrid about his play. Okay. So I'm kind of just waiting on Astrid at this point because I'm guessing she's probably the one that's going to end up moving on sooner rather than anybody else, right? I think that's probably going to end up being the thing. I don't really need to buy anything else except for maybe I want to make one of these because that could be useful. They just need cotton, so I can go make cotton. Cotton fire, cotton thread. Okay, so we're gonna do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten of these and weave. Blip, 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 blip. 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 Okay, there we go. That's pretty good. I want to try something really quick, guys. I've uh, been making some adjustments to my audio as I go. Uh, so one thing I want to do here, it's going to make the game sound a little slow or a little quiet here uh, for just a minute. Or a little quieter, I should say. I think it will. to see what this does it's just an adjustment like i've been re reworking a lot of my uh my audio recently and the only issue i'm finding is i got a new capture card and the capture card tends to be really loud for some reason and i'm not really certain why that's the case i have a theory why that might be happening but this capture card is way louder than the old one. And I don't know why that's the case. But also, I can't find anybody talking about that anywhere. Like, oh, this is a known thing. Like, I can't find it. So, I don't know if it's just like this capture card and that's just how they naturally are now. And I have to adjust based on that, which I'm trying to do for sure. Good morning. I have some food for you. 
I might have food for you. Do you want some coffee, kid? I bet you'll be fine. Uh, you like crepes, but... Let's see. I think I don't... That, wait, no, I thought I had some omelet. There you go, have that. Breakfast! It's exactly the same as before. Awesome. He does like his breakfast. I'll give him that. Hmm. Okay. Hug? Hug, buddy? Yeah, you know you wanted it. You know you want a hug. Wow, you're good at this. I know. I still am very nervous about where his story is going. So, like, I don't know what's going to happen with him. But, like, I kind of get the feeling like he there was something going on with him uh, and his family. Or, like, his mom specifically. I thought they really, really played up the mother thing. Uh, which is something. Did, did you say Stella for some reason? From my house, I was I could always see the snow. Um, way up in the mountains, sometimes there was snow on our house, too. My dad wanted me to go inside with him. We played in the snow. Then, we'd, he'd run off after me. Suddenly, he became a monster. But don't worry, it was all make-believe. I know my dad wasn't a real monster, but when he put up his arms and made a funny voice, I just ran. He chased me, uh, but I couldn't catch, he couldn't catch up to me. And then he became my dad again when I stopped and started laughing. I miss the snow sometimes. Oh. I feel like, but I'm really nervous about Stanley's story because, like, I feel like that's going to be a tearjerker. I have no reason to believe that, but I do think it's going to be a thing. Nope, somebody wants something. Why do you want something when I am heading downstairs? <laughs> Two people want things. Oh, my God, everybody wants something. Scout, I know, I'm going up here. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. Chickadee wants something. Sweet pea. I've got a lead on something incredible. It's huge. Listen up. Apparently, there's this kid in Amber Town heading down to the copies of a uh, Super Saver discount book. No reaction? Nothing? Wow. You kids these days. Everyone and every cent is important, but you can't go around squandering your paycheck. You need to be smart about how you spend your money. Yeah, she's definitely the most annoying of them all so far. Let Bev show you the way. Say, would you uh, buy something? Are you going to pay full price for it? No way. You need to be chasing the details. That's what my mom used to say. And that's what I'm telling you. You just need to be patient and bounce at the right moment. No need to be like a tiger, sweet pea. Let's just say you've been eyeing an archive room B2522 for your boat. Randy at Edinburgh Lane is the only one with the blueprint. Are you going to walk up to him and pay full price? I hope yes means no. In no way should you be paying full price for anything. You're going to have to wait to find a way to bit or have to wait for you're going to have to wait and find a way to pay a bit less. That means taking a detour to Ampertown Park before buying something at Edinburgh Lane. So be it. Don't go and judge uh, just by the archive room B2522 right away. I don't know what that is. It won't be worth it. Not until you uh, say, shave a few glimpses off the asking price. Okay, well, you want me to do something? You, you've got to be hungry, though, right? Uh, what is she, I still don't 100% know what she likes. Do you like fish? I got fish. Oh, thank you. Nom nom noms. Okay, what do you want? Listen, I'll let you in on a little secret. If you keep your mouth shut, you'll be fine. Did you know the garlic has secret properties? Yeah, I know. She is so annoyed. Listen to her eating in the background. Nom 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 nom. Yeah, no, it sounds far fetched, but it's true. My mom ate garlic every day and never got sick. That's why my favorite food has been always been garlic bread. I kept my body in tip-top shape. Now, you need to take this advice to the grave. Okay. I will. You need some food? I need to leave you alone, so I'm not doing anything, but I just need to make sure that you're well-fed. 
Um. I never know what to give you. Because you, I, I know you just like simple things. I guess a salad is probably fine. Mm -hmm. Thank you, Munchkin. Um. Okay. Um, that should be everybody being fed. So I still... Let's see. Something's done. Uh, I can't do that. I'm still waiting on this. Stanley... Oh, I need to... Oh, crap. Hold on. Ingrid, I wasn't done with you. Hold on. Nope, not that. Damn it. Oh, you're in here here. Oh, Stan is so cute, isn't he? With his cute little cheeks and his funny manners. I love kids. Mm -hmm. We connect so much, me and them. You can tell him he was wonderful. He still speaks too fast, though. He should be more articulate. But he was great. Okay. Why are you in uh, Gustav's house? Not you. What are you doing in here? Uh -huh. Oh, it reminded me of my college days. Those early naive experiments from the theater. Such a noble and vibrant art. Uh -huh. Living in performances are not my forte, but I definitely support the concept. That little fellow was technically awful for sure, but his heart was in the right place. He's got that at least. Good, I did that. All right, Stanley, they think you're great. Both of them. Really? Really? Oh, that's all that they all said it like that? Oh, really, really liked it? Are you sure, Big Hat? I don't know. I'm just not convinced. I can see it on your face. Oh, they told me they liked it, but it was not good. Oh, it was terrible. I didn't do it right. I know, even if you're trying to hide it, I just can't do nothing right. I will never make another play. I hate it. Oh, Stanley. Stanley, no. Stanley, I don't know. Maybe later. Stanley, hmm, I don't like hearing so many bad things about me. Why are people so mean? Oh, Stanley, no. That's not, no. Nobody said anything bad, Stanley. I, I think you were great. Work for you. Oh, good. Great news, Stella. I've just received word of a fantastic design for the fireplace. Gold. Oh, silly you. Not for heating up the gallery. No, no, no. The hearth has been since time of immemorial. Um, immemorial. A central piece of any house. Assembles the tribe and present represents unity, warmth, and light against harsh nature. A symbol of so fundamental that it is present in almost all cultures. Uh -huh. A piece of reinterpretational of co the concept, the comment, if you wish. The collective. I'm sure you will understand very clearly once it is built. Okay. I'm going to do this uh, ectoplasm thing because I do need some ectoplasm. No, stop. Let me go outside. I just don't know how to get these guys effectively because they are really fast. And I don't know what I'm doing. And sometimes Stella just stops for no reason. <laughs> come here. Oh, oh, come on. There's so many in one spot and I haven't touched any of them. Get over here. Oh my god. Okay, that was pretty good. Okay, maybe I can get some of these guys. Oh yeah, baby. Give me that. Give me that ectoplasm. Give me that ecto goo. Give me the goo. Give me the goo. I need some goo. All the goo. That's pretty good. I'll take that much goo. Okay, so I'm still... My cow's ready. Nope. What do I have in here? I forgot. Okay, so that one's still working on. I got some cheese. I got some... Nope. More yogurt. And then you're still going. Okie dokie. How are my chickadees doing? They're gone. They're dead. Are my... Oh, they're up there. That's why. <laughs> I thought my chickens were gone. Okay. But they're, they look like they're getting closer to laying eggs. So that is a good sign. Um... Maybe my sheepies need something. Huh. 
Like, I really want to get to... Um, I really want to get that mist breaker thing. Oh. I forgot I was cooking. What was I cooking? Ooh. I made meat stew. That's probably good. That's probably a good thing. And, and look. I found something you might like, perhaps. Here's a gift from my collection. I hope you appreciate the value of such oddities. I do, because they give me glims, and I can sell them. And so, therefore, I love them. Okay. I should cook some more stuff. Uh, let's find out. So let's do... Let's try and do something from here. So I feel like if I can get... Um, more... Mm, let's do something with chicken. Like two chicken pieces. I could do it with olive oil. Why not? Let's do it. I, haven't, I really, really haven't experimented with a lot of this stuff, but I want to see what else we can do with some of this stuff. And I should probably go somewhere. Uh, I still feel like... Okay, so I need to go Neoclassic Nordic Fireplace. How do I build that? Uh, let's see. Okay. You wanted... This desk is from... Uh, wait, no... Okay, so you need steel sheet, zinc ingot, and I should be able to do both of those. So let's go check on some of that stuff. The zinc ingot, I can definitely do. I know that. Uh, steel sheet, that could be a little different. I don't even have the ability to make those. Oh, yes, I do. It's right there. Okay. So I can do that. Nice. Okay, so let's do one of these. I don't remember how much it said I needed to do, though. This is a little harder to do. I feel like I could probably do more. That's pretty good. All right, was that all I needed? I can't remember. I don't remember how many that he needed for this. I should check that. Was it one? I thought it was one. It was one. Okay, so I just need to go make some zinc ingot. And then we're good. That's nice. It's I love it when it's easy. And I have the materials I need. And I don't know where they're not at. Because that makes it a little bit easier on me. Zinc, zinc. Zinc, 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 zinc. Zinc, zinc, zinc. Add the zinc. Make that zinc. Do the zinc. Blah, 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 blah. Get that zinc. Do the zinc. Bloop, 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 bloop. Zinc, 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 zinc. So what I can gather, though, just to kind of get back into like the character stuff, um, you know, Ingrid, Ingrid was a person who spent like time during the war with, um, obviously with um, with uh, with Giovanni. Um, and Giovanni went, went to war. She was part of that, but she was also like in a place where people were actually impacted by the war. So maybe England. Um, and I get the feeling most of this game takes place in like that part of the world. Um, but so she also was like an advocate in her life. She, she was like picketing for workers rights and things like that, which is fine. <laughs> great stuff um i'm out of that so i should do more of this because i think i am very low on corn stuff 
And she, you know, had her issues with Giovanni. And I think she went on a pretty, you know, stark realization of who Giovanni is, but who she is, she didn't need him. And I think that's really important is that she didn't need him, which is really interesting. I don't know, they have a really interesting storyline for sure. I should go build that thing for Gustav. Give him a little little surprise in the morning, you know what I mean? Because he'll probably appreciate it. Oh, I'm not... Oh. Okay. ...that streams is proud to support an ongoing donation drive right here on Twitch for the Lemur Conservation Foundation. It's true, we if do. If you want to support the stream in an awesome way and can afford it, check it out. To learn more, check out the link in chat at thelemurreserve.org. Oh, wait. Oh, I'm still short zinc. Oh, I didn't know it needed that much zinc. Jesus. Okay, hold on. Let me get my silk here. At some point, I will let it just grow to mulberries, because I'm guessing that's the case, right? So once it it starts out as silk and then can become mulberry after that, I guess that must be like the second phase. Um, or maybe it isn't. Maybe I missed it completely, and that is the second phase. But I don't know. Something's done. Oh, that's probably the sauerkraut. Because I know I was waiting on that. Oh, that was too much. Please don't. Thank you. I might be okay here. Good. Okay, so that should be enough zinc. Okay, now I can do it. Beautiful. He'll be happy when he wakes. Well, he might be already be awake. Where is he? Gustav, where did you go? I don't know where Gustav went. He's hiding from me. It's okay. I appreciate him. Um, I need my food because my, my steak and olive oil, I think it was, is done. Ooh. Oh, chicken and olive oil. Fried chicken. I forgot about that. That's what that does. I was right. Okay. So if I do um, more steak and then with glue, no, I'm kidding. I won't do that. Let's do steak and let's do um, root veggies. I don't really want that. Well, steak and potatoes is a pretty common, like good, you know, good quality food. It's a, it's a staple of many people's diets for a reason. So we're going to go with it. And then I... Oh, yeah, the uh, the sauerkraut. Is cow ready to go? Cow. Cow wants milkies. Still not hungry. So, okay. Hmm, that sound. Yum, yum, yum. That is not what I was aiming for. Okay. Oh! That's lovely. Oh, that's so cool. I didn't know that was in here. I can just sit on this chair and relax. What did I just do? Oh, that's so gorgeous. What did I... What does this do? Oh, it just get, lets me kind of reflect on things. That's really beautiful. I didn't know you could do that. That's so cool.
I thought I saw something there, but it is morning time. So I should probably wake everybody up. Get my... I didn't regrow anything, though. I should do that. But I'm going to go wake everybody up before I do that. Because I, I feel like if you don't wake them up, or at least the people who do uh, need wakeys, then they can get mad at you. Um, I'm going to do the sunflowers because I, you did say sunflowers were good for them. And uh, they just make more seeds. So that is good. And we'll just do a bunch of those for my chickens. And then that should be good. Uh, but let me... Oh, I should water. I need to water them. Forgot about that. Okay, uh, sunflower on the way. Did I do these? I don't think I did those. Oh, I didn't plant anything. What did I just plant? I did leak, I guess. Okay. Didn't mean to, but... It, oh, I've got that mystery one. I guess I should do that. I have like three of those. Last time I did something like this, Stanley came out of it, so that was weird. I grew my newest friend. I didn't mean to, but I did. And that's how it went. That's how Stanley was born. I threw some dirt on his head and put water on his face, and suddenly Stanley was born. It's amazing how the world works. All right, what do you like again? I don't really know what you like. You like popcorn? Oh, I guess so, you do. Hugs? Aw. I hate how she eats, but that's fine. Gustav, what do you think of the new stuff, man? I got you the new thing. You didn't you didn't say anything about it. You're not that impressed or what? Hmm. Uh -huh. Well, good. Let's not make this a habit. Alrighty. Um, so Gustav, wait for Gustav to give you more. Astrid is almost done with her best life thing. And head to Edinburgh. Wow, that's what I need to do. I need to go to Edinburgh Lane. Good morning. You're good. Good morning. You're good too. How about you, Scout? Don't, well, okay, you wanted to talk to me, but then you leave. So, what do you want me to do? Edinburgh Lane. We're going to Edinburgh Lane. That's our plan. Edinburgh Lane. Where is that? You're not Edinburgh Lane. All right, so I'll probably stop here and get some Comet Rock while I'm on the way. So we'll probably do that. We'll probably get this. And I think this is Edinburgh Lane. Nope, that is not Edinburgh Lane. You are Edinburgh Lane. Okay, we'll do that. Here we go. I want to check on my chickadees. They're just hanging out. How long does it take them to make eggs? All right. Ooh. Uh, um, um, there we go. Yes, let's do it.
gives me a lot of glimpse, and plus I do need the Comet stuff, because I think Comet Powder does come in handy. I know at some point I'm going to need, like, gold or something, because I think you can get gold. I just, we haven't seen it yet. And if gold's in this game, then I imagine something like Platinum will be there, too. Maybe Diamonds, who knows? If it's following the Minecraft logic, then that is a thing that will definitely happen. Okay, that was better. If nothing else, I feel like I'm I'm finding what I may need to do from game audio perspective. To keep things a little bit more consistent. Because if I do that, then can we put you back at two? Might be okay there. Okay, we'll see. Anyway, let's go check on some peeps because we should be moving by now. We are. Okay, let's go check on Mickey and them. Where'd they go? Because I saw them floating around here. There they go. You gotta be hungry, right? My brother is dying over here. We need food. The time was 30 minutes ago. Okay. Well, listen, buddy. I was busy. Uh, do you want some steak? Do you like steak? I bet you like steak. Let's drop the shade. Get this down on my face. I won't eat the same thing every day. I didn't give you that. When did I give you that? I didn't give you that. I didn't give you steak. No, sauerkraut? Oh, maybe that's what I gave him. But I didn't give him, like, steak, did I? I don't remember doing that. Maybe he wants beef stew? Okay. Free grub, finally. Alright, give me a hug, big guy. I mean, I know they want to take me on a trip, so I'll do that. Alright, alright. Don't tell no one. You got it. I won't tell no one. No how. Okay, so what are we doing? I need that. Astrid is still waiting. You're doing a thing. I'm heading to Edinburgh right now. So we're in a pretty good place overall. How are you doing, Stanley? You're fine. Uh, no. Stanley, what's going on, buddy? Are you, you still feeling bad? I don't get it. People usually like my plays, and I like doing them. Now I don't really feel like doing them anymore. Hmm. Oh. Stanley, that you gotta learn to take criticism better there, big guy. Like, it's not... You weren't bad or nothing. Nobody thought you were bad. You want some fit? I feel like he's really... You know... Oh, okay. I already gave you that. God, it's so hard to keep track of, like, what I already gave you. Here, Paella. Okay. I always forget what I have and have not done. What does that mean? Is that my chickens? Are my chickens doing something? Hey, can you go up? Does this mean I've got eggs? Ah, oh, this must mean I've got eggs. I got eggs. I got so many eggs. I got two eggs. <laughs> Good. Request, beginning and the end. Huh, what does that mean? Uh, we'll give him some sunflower seeds. Beginning and the end. Oh, by the archive room B2522 in Edinburgh Lane. Okay. Stella. Okay, I'm coming. Stella. Okay, what, Stan? I've been thinking about my play and how people didn't like it. And it's okay. And as mom says, they're entitled to the their, their hope onion. <laughs> he means opinion, but fair enough. I'm not angry or sad anymore because of it. I guess there's just things in life you can't really control, can you? Like, uh, Big Hat. Um, I don't think I could be on here anymore. We should go to the Everdoor. Oh. Will you come with me? I think I'm too scared. I don't think I like new places that much, but if you're with me, I think I may be all right. Really? Stanley already? 
I'm so surprised by that. I wasn't expecting Stanley to be the next one. Interesting. I wasn't expecting that. I was expecting, uh, I thought it was going to be Ingrid. Hi. Hmm. Buzz off. Okay, you got it. Edinburgh Lane. I got to buy something from here. Some blueprint for a thing that I don't even know what it is. Boingy. Is it from here? The name's Randy. I know, I know. I met you, uh, aren't you all the merchants supposed to be called Theodore? Yes. But if you're not, stop paying your raccoon franchise to the Raccoon Inc. Listen, hear me out. I know what you're thinking. This guy looks shady. Well, that's right. Uh, that's all. I'd cut off my arm and let's get the best prices. And not just the best prices, the best items. Let's take a look and remember, my name is Randy and my stock can't be beat. Fair enough, Randy. Ooh, bovine license. Um, ooh, this thing. Okay, I can afford that. Let's do it. Got it. You got it. All right. Do you, would you buy things from me? Like, what would you buy? Okay. Failed experiment. Sometimes things don't go your way. It is true. I might have some excess, uh things that I don't... I have so many lightnings in a bottle. Look at that. What is that? Great deforming mirrors? Okay, so I've got 19 of those. What do you do with these anyway? I'm not really 100% certain. Okay, so I've got a lot of sawdust, but not as much as I thought, so I think we'll probably leave that alone. Alright, that's fine. Um, so that was that. Beverly, go talk to Beverly. Stanley wants to go to the Everdor. I can't believe that. I am shocked by Stanley wanting to go to the Everdorm. Like, we we just met him. <laughs> and it's so sudden. It feels so sudden. Everything feels so sudden with him. But I do need that. I do need the flower, though. Like, I, uh, I kind of need it. All right. Well, let's go talk to some people. Oh, someone, my food's done. What did I cook? I forgot what I cooked. More meat stew. Okay, I guess there's more than one way to make meat stew. Did not know that. I'm very disappointed in you, Stella. You're always in a hurry. If you could press a button and order everything, would you do it? Even at exorbitant price? In any case, you should go ahead and build archive room B2522. If you've bought it, you've earned it. Right. I, I didn't mean to, like, upset you. I don't know why I'm in here. What is this? Okay. Oh, something new. Uh, Francis says, it's your lucky day. Oh, how lucky you must be. I have a new errand for you. Fresh off the presses. Have a look-see. Okay, but I don't really want it. Uh, ooh. It gives me peach seed and glims. A treasure map for that. I mean, I could do some of these, but... Ooh, what's this? Tomato seed and... Ooh, I'll do it. Hell yeah. Okay. That gives me more garlic seed and glims. Amethyst. Honey. Honey for my honey. Mmm. Ooh, and I got these. That's an opal. I don't really know what you do with opals. There's some things in here I don't really want. Alright, let me sell some things. I do have these, so we'll sell this, 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 this. Perfect. Alright, I got so many glims. Um... Hey, Gecko, what's going on? Pretty good. We're just, um, we're just getting some storylines going. Hello. Gecko, Gecko, Gecko. The spirits be faring quite well today. Yes. Chilling and Spiritfarer like the cool creatures they are. Yeah. They're probably having a better time than Neeson in a video game. That's well, for sure. Well. Where'd y'all learn to speak furry? Well, archive room. Oh, I can almost do this, too. So it just takes, like, some more ash planks. Uh, hi to you, too, Theo. Yeah, Theo's saying hello. 
Uh, so we're good. Uh, the sad thing is, freaking Theodore already wants to go to the Everdorm. He already wants to go. I don't know what that's about, but apparently he wants to go to the Everdorm. Um, so I guess I should set that course. Theodore, the big squirrel? No, no, not Theodore. I'm sorry, Stanley does. Stanley. I don't know why I got them, their names confused, but yeah, no, Stanley wants to go to the Everdorm. Like, already. It's weird, right? A little weird. Where is it? Right here. Okay. Okay, so I'm here. Whoops. I guess I can't go anywhere. Okay, that's fine. Um, yeah, so Stanley already wants to go. I guess I'm going to hang out with you all night. Um, let's see. Oh, that makes more sense. Theodore is making too much money to want to leave, right? Well, we just met Randy, who is one of them, like one of the Theodores, but apparently he didn't pay his um, franchise fee, so he's no longer... Uh, we also have a chicken coop. I, I built a chicken coop, so that's good. But uh, yeah, I guess he did. Randy didn't pay his franchise fee, so he lost his naming rights or whatever. Big shame that, right? Linen fiber. You can you can feed them linen fiber. That seems kind of weird. You have um. Spirit farmer? Exactly. Um, but yeah, so we're going to go. I think we're going to have to do it, though, because um, I, in order for me to move forward, I've, I've kind of reached a point where I have to get something to move forward. And the only thing I'm missing is what Stanley can give me. <laughs> uh, I'm going to let those grow more and see if I actually get the mulberries this time. So what I'm probably going to do is sleep until morning and then we're going to make our way over there uh, to get this done because I don't really have anything else I need to do. I'm getting really efficient. I've become so efficient at this game. It's actually quite crazy. Yes, please. Okay, so let's get our heading on the way. We'll head over to the spirit door. I guess in the end, like, I guess I'm really not 100% on, um, like, Stanley, Stanley's story as much. I, I get the feeling that, I mean, I guess my immediate feeling is that he was a, I mean, he obviously was a child, um, but he also was, I think, probably abused by I, I get the feeling it might have been his mother I get that feeling but I guess I don't know like what his the reason why he's here thing is because it seems like um, he had a rough time of it he has very low self esteem uh, that's part of the reason why a new design oh Stella I've received the most amazing submission it, this is for design for clock one of the strongest symbols of humanity's dedication to rising above the lowly station. For a measure of times beats the path of its accounting, which in turn allows for long-term planning. Mm. But when first humans start at this carousel and seem pointless task of measuring time, uh -huh. they exerted themselves for an instant. Hmm. They stopped surviving on as animals, and instead they surviving as a species. Uh -huh. Humanity was born when the apes decided Ah, uh, that, that, that they would be play timekeepers. Hmm. Oh, sorry. I was lost in my thoughts. Uh -huh. Anyway, I'm quite excited about this new design and entrusted to you. Great. You're good. Let me... I wanna, uh -huh. No, I'm afraid that will not do. Uh, hi, Stanley. You hungry? I, I feel bad, though, because I'm going to... Mm. I don't think Stanley was abused. I think he's been dealing with pretty debilitating disease. Probably stressed out his mom, so uh, he feels bad because of it. Yeah, maybe that's it. That could be true. Um, because I, I guess it was it was really difficult to understand like 
what was going on with him exactly. Um, so it was really difficult to understand exactly what was happening. And maybe that was it. But he must have had a, a bad disease. And I guess that's why he's here uh, with us. That would make sense uh, to a certain degree, right? So... I mean, still very, very sad if that's the case. Like, it doesn't change much except for the fact that he is dying. He also seems, like I said, he seems to have a very debilitating... Like, he has a very low sense of self-worth. Um, or, like, he's very easily discouraged. Um, so, I don't know. Oh, look what I drew. I did this drawing for you. A drawing of Gustav? Oh, that's adorable. Can I see that? Wait, can I see it? Yes. How can I... Can you look at it? Self-confidence issues. I know the feeling. Yeah, true. I mean, we all have been there for sure. Um, can I get around you, Stan? I need to I need to exit this building. I'm sorry. Okay, there we go. Um, oh, I'm ready to go to where he's following me around right now. Okay, somebody else wants something. I don't know what you want, but I'm a little busy right now. I know you guys always think that you are my top priority, but you're not all the time. Uh, let's go here. And then we'll just feed everybody and get going on this. But yeah, I feel like, yeah, he definitely has self-confidence issues. Like, we did the whole play portion. Like, he did a play for everybody. And everyone gave him, like, kind of honest, um, like, honest feedback on it. And, uh... Stella, mm -hmm. Munchkin, I am, I'm so tired, mm -hmm. so old, I can't, I can't do it anymore, mm -hmm. I can't go much further, will you do me a favor, please bring me there, sweetheart, mm -hmm. bring me to where it ends, oh my god, they both want to go, uh, how does that work, how does, how does it work if they both want to go? This is going to be interesting because it's like a double dose here, right? Double whammy. Whoa. I know, right? Craziness. Um, let's do this one. Oh, thank you, Munchkin. Okay. I need to give her a hug. If this is the last hug I get from you. How do they handle this type of situation, though? That's what I want to know. I'm very curious about that. Very curious how that's going to work. Where's my boys? We. I didn't see him anywhere. There they are. I can see it so vividly. Mickey was a kid. Young. Too young. Some pieces of shit comes out of nowhere and hits me with a baseball bat. Didn't even see the shit stain. But my body goes limp when he hits the ground. Mickey's red. Like a tomato. He grabs the guy who's still hitting me with the bat, by the way. He throws the, uh, the asshole... Uh, into the side of the car and the windows shatter. That guy uh, has glass all over him. He's screaming repeatedly like, it's in my eyes, it's in my eyes. Blood is coming out of his eyes and Mickey, well, he was just laughing. What a laugh. The thing could uh, lull me to sleep. Well, that is very interesting. Very violent. And yes, language indeed. Language indeed. Uh, okay, here we go. Uh, let's do this. So I guess the question is, how? I'm curious how they're going to handle this situation, because uh, I don't under I don't know. Okay, what do you want? You need gold and rose gold sheet. Okay, that'll be interesting because I don't have gold. So gold must be something. I think you bring them one out one at a time. Well, that I would imagine that's the case, but I'm, I'm curious how they're going to decide who goes first here. Oh, I just... Okay, this is how it's going to work. So they're both going to want to do a thing. Big hat. Where are you at? Stanley? Where'd you go? Stanley? I don't know where he is. Stanley? Stanley? 
Uh, I know you're there. I just can't see you. Oh, you're hiding behind. <laughs> Only the cool kids join the conspiracy on Discord. So I didn't I know he was behind that there. thing. Just saying. You decide. Yes, I'm gonna take Stanley first because I, I think um, I feel like this is happening. Hide and seek champion, right? He was man. That was insane. Um, I think Stanley's story is probably very uh sad. But I, I feel like this happened so fast that I don't even know. Um, I don't even know that much about it at this point. So that is uh, interesting, right? Because like he, I almost forgot something. Oh. I liked it when it was just you and me doing experiments, uh, running around chasing dust shades. Don't forget that. Do that sometimes. I won't be there, but I'm sure it will still be fun. Oh. I mean, I'm still going to feel sad, right? I'm still going to feel real sad. But, I don't know. Okay. People can be mean. Don't worry. My little fungi are doing just fine. Godspeed, my little fungi. They're probably off on their own epic adventure, growing and sporing all over the place. Right? Mushrooms sure know how to party. They the do. the spores be with they them really on do. their magical journey. <laughs> um, give me one second. I'll get right back into this. Nope, I don't want to do that. Uh, what am I doing? I'm trying to... Damn it. Okay, this one. Is it this, maybe? Yeah. Okay, so if I do that and that and that, that should kind of give it a little better of a look. There we go. Okay. All right, people can be so mean, really mean. I'm proud of them, Theo. <laughs> exactly. Why do they have to be? My mom is mean sometimes just like your friends after my play and it makes me sad when people are mean and sometimes I cry when I'm sad but then I remember I remember what my dad used to say Stanley people are not really mean sometimes their intentions uh, take the wrong path and I don't hate your friends they're, they're not bad people that's what my dad would say uh, it, it, they just do bad things sometimes I never wanted to let my mom down or make people not like me. I don't want to do bad things, but sometimes I do, and I always regret it. I don't think that makes me bad. Do you, do you think my mom would be disappointed in me? Dis disappointed that I had to go? I tried. I really tried, but... I don't think I did it. I like it when I win, but I couldn't this time. I think it's okay. It's okay to lose sometimes. I really think it is. I'm really trying to be brave, but I'm, I'm really scared. I wish I could be a superhero and never be afraid. I've hoped so much that this would just be a nightmare. If this is a nightmare, why why can't I wake up? I was trying. <laughs> trying and trying. I wanted to wake up. I always talk to myself. <laughs> Stanley wants to wake up. But it never worked. I never woke up. <laughs> it all felt so real. And it made me sad. <laughs> so sad, I couldn't think of anything other than sadness. <laughs> you take care of Jacob, okay? Jacob is a good beetle. And then he was my friend. Oh. This is exactly like in my play. But this time I'm the lead actor. I will put on a good show, I promise.
Yeah, I think I think Gecko, I think you might have been right. I think that it was that he had a serious disease. Maybe he had like I don't know. I don't I can't really say what it was, but I think it he died from it and that's why his mom was so upset because she just didn't know how to deal with it and he feels responsible for it. I feel strange. I feel cold. I wish mom was here. Dad. But you're here, big hat. I really like you. I hope it's like falling asleep. That one, uh, I wasn't expecting that one to hit as hard as it did, uh, but it really did. <laughs> that one hits hard. Ooh. 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 Hey, Crispy, what's going on? How are you? Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, just you wait, because uh, it's a double whammy. Can you even imagine how parents feel? Never want to outlive your children? No, that would be... I can't even imagine that. And I, don't even, I don't have kids, but my sister does. Um, so I, I, I'm an uncle to two, technically three. Um, and I can't even imagine that. I can't even imagine what that would feel like if for, for, for Rachel, my sister, um, if that were to happen, right? Like, if something like that were to happen to one of my nieces, oh my god. Because it's like, you, you meet them, and they're so full of life, and they're doing just everything they can to be alive, and they don't know what death is, they don't understand it, like that, and then like, your parents just, they want to see them grow up, that's like the point, right? Mm-hmm. Ah. <sighs> We finally arrived. I feel so weak. Can we go now? Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's do this. I can't hold it any longer. All right, let's do it. I can't believe it's a double whammy like this. I really can't. I mean, that's it. That's just, that's, oh man. Ooh. Here we go again. Like, seriously. I don't think it's wise to live that long, Munchkin. Yeah, my nieces and nephews are and are homie, and my niece uh, has thyroid cancer, and it keeps. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. That's so horrible. And I imagine like this, the uncertainty of it all is just so hard. But hopefully, she's pulling through. And it sounds like she's gotten through it a few times. I'm really sorry, though. Good thing I've been that wise. But boy, am I old. And being this old is disappointing. You just end up being ugly on the outside and rotten on the inside. Mm -hmm. And it hurts so much. Life is suffering. It is hard. Mm -hmm. And the world is cursed. But still, you find reasons to keep on living. Yeah, so much pain for no reason. Yeah, I know. It's part of life, you know, that life comes with so many different things like they're so unpredictable i mean there isn't a reason for it and it's not like they deserve it or, or there's a reason or anything like that sometimes you know things we're, we're very we're incredibly complex creatures all life forms are just incredibly complex and when you have things that are that complex i guess that makes it just really difficult to, to fathom the idea that something sometimes things just just don't go the way you want them to and it's really hard it's really hard to understand but still you find reasons to keep on living. Mm -hmm. I don't regret a thing, you know. I don't regret the struggles. I don't regret the hardships, mm -hmm. the pain, the sorrow. And I've seen so much of it. Mm -hmm. But still, I don't regret what I've done or how I've lived my life. I wish the world had been a better place, mm -hmm. a better place for them for us but surely a better place for you my dear 
Mm -hmm. I feel like a vast vessel with so many dusty rooms and cabins. I have so many of them. So many memories. Mm -hmm. Some of them are gone, but some of them, some of them will live on forever. In you, in others. Mm -hmm. I remember their faces as they trembled in fear. I remember their houses and their parties they threw. I remember their songs and their love. Mm -hmm. I remember their touch, their warmth. It's all fading away now, Munchkin. It's fading away. Mm -hmm. It's all gray, all white, all foggy. Is it all gone already? I don't see much anymore. You're still here with me, aren't you? Mm -hmm. You're still here, Stella? Don't forget about me, please. I don't care about anybody else. Mm -hmm. But you, you don't forget about me. I'm telling you. I'll come back and haunt you if you do. Mm -hmm. I can feel it coming. Goodbye, Stella. Just follow your heart and keep smiling. Oh. Yeah, true. Who can forget her? She was very different. Um, and she seemed to have lived a very interesting life. But it sounds like she was older than I even thought. Because she... She seemed to be losing it towards the end there. But, man. Ooh, two of those in a row, huh? <laughs> That's, uh, that's interesting. That is, uh, not what I was expecting. Man. Request complete. A lover's for life. We ended up losing her and, uh, Giovanni in such short order like that. But, what that means is, guys, is that we can now... It is nighttime, so I guess I can't really do a whole lot. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. My bad. Please don't wake up. I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I'm sorry. That was an accident. No, please don't get up. Ship gonna be a lot quieter now. It sure is. Uh, except for... Um, Wake up, I'm sad, right? Yeah, I need everybody to wake up. I'm real sad right now. You guys need to get off your asses and in here to console me. I need hugs pronto. Exactly. Although, that only leaves me with like three people. Ah, man, that's insane. So we're going to have to find um, time for hugs. Everybody get up, right? We're going to have to find um, gold now because I need gold. But, first things first, uh, sorry to wake you guys up. I didn't mean that. Please don't wake up on it. Oh, they're both awake. Oh, man. Okay, let me get some eggs. Yay. I got eggs. Excuse me. Sorry about waking you up. I'm gonna milk a cow. Time to milk. I'm gonna milk ya. Thank you. I forgot my milk. All right. So I think what we're going to need to do now is head over to Albert, the shipwright, and get some things. So what I'm going to do is I'm probably just going to go to sleep so we can get moving. And then we'll head over to Albert here and get that all taken care of. Everybody should be awake already because I kind of accidentally woke everybody up. 
my bad, my B. Uh, but we should be able to get the mist cleaner now. Which I know, most important thing in the world, right? But we should be able to do it. Um, so what I'm going to do... Why are you here? <laughs> what are you... Odd seed. Oh. Well, last time I bought an odd seed from you... Stan or Stanley showed up, so that that's weird. I feel like that's how Stanley showed up. But I guess we'll see. Stella, back home, uh, no one would ever let us starve like this. Well, I'm not trying to make you starve. You're just annoying and I hate listening to you eat. Oh, thank you. Wait, why did we stop? Thank you, sweet pea. Wait, where's my dude? Didn't I come here because the dude was here? A gift. Here is a fire glow. Don't be shy. Make something extra spicy, please. Oh, I bet she likes spicy. Okay, that's good to know. Where's my dude at? Wait, hold on. Did he leave? No, he should be right here. Was I just like a millimeter off or something? Is that the deal? Okay, I must be. I must have been like a millimeter off. Uh, you said you had a boot, which is great. Also, oh, could turn into anything. Those are good, though. I'm going to get those. Uh, all right. Thanks, buddy. Um, do I have anything to sell you? What just happened to you? Oh. Well, no, I'm not going to do that. That would be horrible of me. Um, all right. Well, now that I got that, I guess we'll just move on. Uh, let's go to here. We're just going to go to the shipwright, get that on our way. While we're doing that, let me check on everybody. Ship feels a lot emptier now, though, doesn't it? <laughs> feels a lot emptier. Uh -huh. Stanley's laugh gift, a commission for the burb. Exactly. I'm sure you could find me something nutritious. I'm sure I could. I'm sure that I could. Do you want some clams? Huh? Ah, this will surely turn some heads. Only a narrow mind did you call this an acquired taste? That's simply higher quality food. I bet it was. Okay, you're no longer hungry, but my dude's here, so let me go take care of this situation, and then, then we'll just go. And I think we just go here. Alright, here we are, so let's go plot a course for the ship, and then I gotta go feed Mickey. And what what's the what's the hummingbird's name? I know it's Mickey and, and what's his name? Mickey's the, the the ox. But what is your name? Bruce, 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 kid. My brother's been asking when you're gonna get fed already. Well you guys eat a lot. Like I can't like you guys eat often. It's a little bit overwhelming sometimes. Do you want um I think I just gave you that sauerkraut meal? Um fried chicken? You want some fried chicken? How about that? Yum. Good. Good, you're good. Alright, let me give you a hug. Because I think I'm about to go, like, camping with these two. That should be interesting, right? Alright, don't tell no one. Okay, here we go. Shipwright. Let's do this. Let's do this. Shall we? Let's get the mist thingy. That should be good. Hello, my old friend. I hope there's a mirror on that cell of yours. Because it's looking good. <laughs> that was uh, that was fantastic. Thank you, sir. Appreciate that. Okay, mist cleaner, moon solo. 
Oh, oh, it makes ahead of the nighttime makes a boat go 60% faster. Ooh. Well, that's something. Um, okay, so I need this, and that should do that. So I got the mist cleaner now. So now we can go to a different place. I still have 40,000 glims. So I could make the ship bigger. And I'm going to do that. So my floating village can expand even further, which should be good. Oh, I knitted this for you earlier. It should keep you warm, nice and warm, if the weather ever takes a turn for the worse. Wool fabric? I got mail! Holy shit. New Island, boss. Overbrook brochure. Interesting. Okay, so let's get on the road now that we can do this. Okay, so I've got a few places I need to go. There's Overbrook, and then there's... Okay, so this is where I'd get that, and I can get tomato seeds and a bunch of shit from that. That's kind of cool. Uh, it looks like that, or there was a spot way over here that we were we haven't been able to get to. The Crow's End. Interesting. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go here. And then we'll do that. How much space do I have now? I gotta have like a shit ton of space. Over here. Let's go take that vacation in Grey Mist Peaks. Okay, I'm gonna do that. Oh my God, I got so much space over here. Jesus, that's insanity. It also usually increases like the height at which you can grow or, you know, you can space everything out too, right? So, um. I just want to see. Oh, that grid's insane. Okay. So I am going to move you over here uh, next to all my industrial stuff. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. There. That's a little bit more the idea of what I'm trying to do. And then I can also move this down to here. So this way... I can get from one end of the ship to the other really quickly. Okay. Um, let's go. Okay, so we're going to do the Gray Mist Peaks thing. So I think if I go here, that's probably the quickest way to do that. So let's go see what this is all about over here. I haven't done the mist stuff yet. I'm um, hoping that they'll have gold because I think that is like a big piece of what I need now is gold. Um, and then I also need archive room B2522, whatever that means. And I think I needed, what did I need for that? I wasn't sure if that required something special. Let's find out. I forgot. Okay, you're not archive room. Maybe it's in here. Archive room. I just need ash blanks. I could build that. Okay. I could do it. I could build ash if I need to. Maybe I'll do that on the way to this place. Maybe that's what we'll do. So I can go to Overbrook. Maybe I could stop by Overbrook on the way there. So let's just go here. We'll stop at Overbrook. There's probably going to be another spirit on one of these, would be my guess is that we're going to run into somebody who is going to need our help at some point. Where's my sawmill? At the bottom. Oh, it's on the bottom here. Okay. I needed ash planks? Right? It was ash planks. I think. Oh, it is... Uh, the, that is not helping me with the logs. That's okay. Uh, 
that was horrible. <laughs> I did really bad there. Uh, okay, so we're gonna make some woody, wood, 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 wood. Okay. Okay, so we are in this overbook place, but I think that gives me everything I need for this thing they want me to make. Interesting. Well, that's a different. That looks like kind of like a. I love this design of this area, though. It's like this, like a uh, real. Okay, let's see. That is what I needed. Okay, so this is gonna go over here somewhere. I guess above my cow. This is getting insane, though, is all I can say. But that's fine. Also. I need to do some things. Let me go see. How is that doing? Jenga fair? We did that for sure. We have fared quite illustriously. Look at that. We did it. Right, lady? Aren't you happy? Oh, rain really ruins your day, doesn't it? Yes, but not bad. Okay, I'm just going to go in here. No, this looks great. This reminds me a bit of my late husband David's classroom. Obviously, you never met him, but you know he was a high school teacher. You already knew that. Oh, the room. Ah, it's just very similar. You should go inside and take a peek. Maybe the projector still works. What does it do? Right, project. I don't have anything. Oh. Nothing to show. You could try this. It was my husband's work thing. Maybe it will work. Okay. Let's see what we got. Math lecture notes. Yep, they sure were. Oh, wow. David was a math teacher. I taught it. He taught at Chelsea High School for 20 years. We met a blind date. A bachelor snatched me up quickly in a small town. My friend Pauline matched us up. She was a school secretary. That school has never been in shambles without her. She was the first to see him call me to the second, and he was out of her sight. Bev, I met the love of your life. How about that? She was right to a point. I was the love of his life. He was gone too quickly to be the love of mine. I never met anyone special as him. He had a warmth that I was never able to find again. Well, what are you looking at? It must be a formula or something. I've never been too that great at math. My brain gets confused. Gets confused. My mouth gets confused. My brain gets confused with numbers. I have that in common with... Hmm, she told me that isn't uh, great with... I'm just tired. I can feel it in my bones. Don't ever get old, Stella. I wouldn't suit you. Well, maybe I didn't. Why can't I move? Oh. Moo! I know the cow was doing something. The cow needed some milk. Or me needed to milk it. Because it was getting uncomfortable. So I guess that's fine. Um. Alright, so we did that. So I'm like down to very few things. So let's just go do what we gotta do here in this place. Whoop. And uh, I just want to take a look around here and see what the dealio is. I don't know if anything's going to be here worth me doing, but you never know. Hmm. Already there's something here. Oh, you look terrifying, whatever you are. Oh, that ain't good. I don't. Mm, it's not. Wait. Hey, wait. It's you. Stellar's. Uh, your old pal, Jackie. What is your old pal, Jackie? Jackie? Ha, huh. coming to the rescue again, aren't you? Well, let me pick you, tell you. I have no idea what happened. I was hiding a... I mean, I was taking a short break. Yeah, from my shift. And then I saw this old beat-up vending machine. Oh. Funny how I never noticed it before. But then, as soon as I approached the machine, the whole place got all foggy. Well, weird stuff, man. Weird stuff. Maybe something broke somewhere. Anyway. Yeah, you. Watching. I see. Exactly. You. If you have not not much power, you can do until do management sends the maintenance crew, Come I guess. On. Really can't work like that. I can barely see. 
On top of that, the machine's almost empty. Damn, management probably never refilled it, lazy bums. One good thing that is I could see a tasty Choco Blasters. Oh. Although I forgot my wallet and my coat up there. Hey, uh, do you think you could get it for me? Hmm. Fog coming out of nowhere. It's either missed by the Stephen King or Silent Hill. It could be. It could very well be. Hi-Fi Wolf, what's going on? I have to come in and lurk uh, and slide into Theo's DMs. Okay, go for it. Uh, see, ow! How dare you? But yes. Get into Theo's DMs. He'll do it. A snack attack. Okay, so I gotta do a snack attack. Oh, how do I do this? I can get a Choco Blaster. That's it? That's all I gotta do? Thank you. Thank you. Oh, and then the fog is still there, so that didn't do anything. Oh, yeah. Uh, Choco Blasters, let's blast off. I'll, uh... What the... Oh. Holy shit, we're doing this right here? Oh, my goodness. Oh, those are some teeth right there. Whoa, that was far out. Did you see that machine? It was all glowy and shit. Like that fancy thing you're wearing on your belt. Nice bobble, by the way. Now, about that Choco Blasters. What? It's already half eaten? What the? That's just gross. Never mind that. I'm not hungry anymore. Wonder why. Anyway, seems like whatever's going on is over now. Well, back to the old grind for old Jackie. Hey, you know what could be fun? A tour of the place. You didn't come over to Overbrook for uh, nothing, right? Let Jackie give the old VIP tour. How about it, yeah? <laughs> ha, knew it. Anyways, we're a uh, sucker for these kind of things. Teacher's pet and all that. I can read you like an open book, Stellars. Yeen, I know. It's a, and it's like a friend of Stella's, I guess, from school. It seems like that's the case. All right, all right, let's go. And if you get scared, just grab my arm. <laughs> Oh my god, what happened to your arm? I don't... Dude, what the... What is... What is... Is that flower on your arm? Okay. Okay. I had a little accident. I sneezed so hard that my dinner came out my nose. I hope I can put it back in. I don't want to be wasteful. <laughs> so, this is a general admission wing. I use it for, uh, hey, that's Jamie. Hey, Jamie, hey. Oh, hey, Jackie. What's up? Oh, nothing much, not much. Just, uh, give my pal here a tour of the whole hospital. Mm -hmm. This is Stella, by the way. Uh, psst, Jamie, uh, don't mention toes, okay? Uh, I hear she's got six of them, and she's very sensitive about it. Oh, really? He hello, Stella. Nice to meet you. Thanks for telling me. I wouldn't want to. Mm -hmm. Or, whoa there, uh, you made the lady mad. Relax, Stellars, it's just a goof. Oh. You smell like, uh, flowers and candies and newborn babies. Hey, that rhymes. Right, Jamie? Oh, uh, huh, yeah, yeah, yes. Oh, good one, Jackie, good one, you're a riot. Yeah, thanks, Jamie. Uh, talk to you later. Yeah, sorry about that, I'm kind of a local star around here. Oh. They, uh, can't get enough of old Jackie. Everyone loves me so much, I suspect, uh, there's some sort of fake in their illness just to stick around. Anyway, let's move on. Okay. Jackie seems like a very interesting character so far. Very, very interesting design work, too. Another friend. Hey, buddy, what are you up to? Oh, um, I'm an orderly, finally. Uh, is anyone working in this hospital? I earn it's... I, uh, uh, stop drooling and just do your job. People are hungry, and this place is filthy. Mm. People are supposed to get healthier here, not sicker. Uh, what? Nothing to say? Mm. Never mind this guy, Stellars. He's an idiot. Hey, I'm right. Yeah, yeah, moving on. Okay, so he apparently worked at the hospital, maybe? Because I kind of get the feeling that Stella had something to do with this, like, a hospital. Wow, this place is really... Not doing good. Oh, he went up there. Okay. Can you believe it? 
Oh, the nerve of this guy. Really, what was that about? I'm out here busting my ass every day, every night. Oh. To pay the crap hours, are, and the pay is crap and the hours are worse. And on top of that, I've got this entitled shithead all up in my crack with his bullshit. This place is filthy. Oh no, I'm hungry. What do I do? What do I do? <laughs> do I tell you how to do your job? No, I don't, because I have some manners. And I don't know what the first thing about shoveling shit. I mean, what? Oh, what's this? It's, uh, oh shit. It's the room of a very special patient. Very troubled. Very, uh, difficult. But there's no way up there anymore. The ladder probably broke while I was getting a snack. Well, can't do much about that. Not until management get hits you anyway. Mm -hmm. She'll be fine for a while. Plus, I could really use the time off. She really is a handful. All right. Follow Jackie around at the Overbrook Hospital. Fair enough. Last stop. And finally, the cafeteria. Always on duty uh, for all of your slop needs. Oh, hey, Jackie. Back from break, are you? Oh, yeah, I guess I am. Do you need anything? Um, well, you see, I wanted to grab a bite here, but apparently the kitchen's out of supplies. Yeah, figures. I swear these idiots up here are going to starve us all to death. I'm sure they're out for a cruise for a corporate retreat. Hey, don't worry, Jackie's on it. I'm sure you are. Thanks for watching out for us, Jackie. Eh, don't mention it. Well now, where could I... Oh, Stellars. You always uh, were oh so helpful. You wouldn't happen to have some kitchen supplies in that big boat of yours, would you? Five bags of rice should do the trick until your next shipment. I would owe you one. Okay. Do I just give them? Oh, I can't. Let me give him a hug. Hey, Gecko. Machinta, who's the cute MF leaf that... Who is this cute MF leaf that uh, MF streams? I don't know. I can't tell you. It's a secret. How are you doing, Machinta? Hope you're doing well. Oof, yeah. Needed that. Don't get any, uh, nearly enough hugs. Okay, so... I guess they want rice or something, but... I don't know. What do you... What do you think they eat? What do you think they're... They're... Maybe this? Right on. Thanks for the meal. I was starving. Okay. So... The shop... The slop shop. Okay. Uh, the characters in this game are such pretty designs. How have you been enjoying it so far? I love this game. Um... We just had a double dose of saying goodbye to two characters. Uh, so we lost Stanley and we lost um, Ingrid, like back to back. They literally both wanted to go at the same time. Uh, doing fully well, recovered. So here's do being, or here's hoping I could join uh, you on your next stream uh, or next stream when you're otter and such. Oh, okay. So yeah, we are probably going to do more played up on Wednesday. Uh, I hope you're doing okay. I didn't know you were down and out for a bit there, but that's I'm glad to see you're doing better. Uh, but yeah, we are going to be probably playing on Wednesday again, so for more plate up, so I would be glad to have you there. Am I on? Oh. We're not open yet. Trust me, you'll know when it's ready. Smell a certain kind of way. Uh, how do I... Oh... Bring five bags of rice to you. I might have that. Where did you go? Jackie? Uh, but yeah, Hi-Fi. No, this game is great. Um, it's very emotional. Um, so the game can be, you know, tough at times because you are facing a lot of things that are very emotional, very powerful. But I appreciate it about it. It, it is, how do I give you the rice? It's not letting me do it. Bring... Unless I just don't have it. Maybe I just don't have it. Uh, oh, I like the sound of that. Yeah, it's it's um, it's um incredibly well done. So I would say... I only have four. <laughs> Crap. I only have four bags of rice. Okay. So if I want my friend here to come with us, I'm going to have to plant some rice. Okay, that's fine. Um, I guess that's the next stop. Okay. Well, let's, uh, can I just buy things from this? Oh, I can. 
Interesting. What's in here? Nothing. Okay, we'll move on. But yeah, no, it's really interesting because I didn't know... Like, when I got into this, I didn't know how, like, deep this game actually could be. And what's really cool about it is that it does seem like the whole thing is really all about um, dealing with and, um, like, just basically just dealing with loss and dealing with death. And that's really interesting to me. Like, I don't know many games that could pull something like this off. Um, but it is really touching at points. And, like, the really the interesting part about it is, is, like, I do feel like Stella being the main character of the game is that we're, we're actually seeing snippets of her life and her dealing with things. Um, do I even have rice? Oh, shit. I don't have any rice. What was that? Okay. But it's like, I think we're seeing a lot of snippets from Stella's life. Um, and I think all of this is a metaphor for that type of thing. I do enjoy being on this boat. I've been wondering, would it be possible to build me a house? You remember the kinds that Divin and, uh, David and I lived at the farm. We had the nature all around. We had dogs and goats. We had a cozy little farmhouse. It wasn't much, but it was ours. Ah! Didn't it? What am I saying? You already done that for me. I was just testing you. Uh-oh. To see if you were quick on your feet. Oh. I can see you're still sharp. Which reminds me, I got that, uh, get that, my kitchen knife sharpened. Uh, that's just something for my, uh, childhood friend Daryl didn't do. Oh. oh, no. He was cutting vegetables one day, and just like that, the, ba the blade bent, broke, and shattered all over the place. Mostly in his face. He had bandages on his face from all the cuts. His wife, Hannah, left him. Not because of the cuts, but because he had a secret family in two towns over. Oh. Just goes to show that you can't trust a man who doesn't sharpen his knives. Well, I'll... Er, I'll just uh, go home. Uh, oh, but that's not... That's not where your home is. Oh, no. Is she got memory issues like, um, like Alice did? Is, oh, that was... That was... I think so far, I think I will say, I think the Alice one was the most difficult, right? Um, oh, yeah, the knife to the face thing. Oh, yeah, you guys are here. Um, yeah, that was pretty terrible sounding, actually. Um, but I do think that so far, if I had to choose, I think the Alice one was the most difficult because of the setup to it was so devastating because you just didn't know. Hey, what's going on? Coop, how's it going? Welcome to the stream. Hey, Coop, thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate that. How's everybody doing? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Welcome, welcome Raiders. What's going on? What were you guys up to? What were you guys playing? And, and welcome to the stream. If you guys are new here, my name is Naze and I am the Lean the Streams. Uh, we are a variety streamer. Today we were playing some Spirit Fair or some Come enjoy some very emotional stuff with us if you are wanting to do so. We are happy to have you here. And in the meantime, let me give Coop a good old shout out and see what you guys are up to. You were playing Yakuza. Yakuza, welcome. That's awesome. Get my ass. I kind of need my ass. You, you know, for, for sitting and all that. <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> that was perfect time for that one. I love that. <laughs> Dude, I loved Yakuza. I know you were playing it not too. Uh, I don't know if you were playing Yakuza 0, but you were playing something recently like that, right? Uh, would you look at that? Look at Cooper Raccoon with all the love. Uh, Cooper heart, Cooper heart, Cooper heart. Yep. Spread in the furry love like a raccoon on a mission. Keep those Cooper hearts coming, my raccoon friend. There you go. That was very kind of you, Theo. Very good. That's This is what I'm talking about. The open air, the breathing in scout. That's the good stuff. This reminds me. You should have these. Mickey says he doesn't want his. You should have mine, too. We don't need them anymore. Yep, that's the one. <laughs> Listen. 
I think we need to uh, rethink our role in our organization. If Mickey doesn't mind, I'm going to need you to run point on some things. You would uh, have more involved role, if you know what I mean. I'll fill you in when we get on the boat. Go do your thing. You earned it. We'll hang back. I got another oval. What do they want me to do? Talk to Bruce and Mickey. Was that it? Was that the entire camping trip? Was just us coming here to tell me, Hi, Theodore. Do you have rice, by the way? <laughs> Onion seed. Arcade, what's going on? How are you doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome. I am need rice. Rice would be nice. I has no rice. Shortest camping trip ever. I know. That was the shortest camping trip of all time. Uh, those are expensive. My goodness. Onion seeds are expensive. I'll buy a couple of those, but like, I'm not going to buy a ton. I get some tomato seeds. Those are also kind of expensive. Those are a little bit less, but peaches are cheap, I guess. That was really expensive. Peaches were super cheap or expensive. Goodness me. Also, what is Theodore doing here? This is terrible. I don't even know how to go back. Well, whoa, that looks like a rope that I could use. Um, okay. Can I get up there? Oh, I could use that to bounce. Okay, cool. Nope, I pushed the wrong button. Boingy, boingy, boingy. Here we go. What is this? What am I doing here? Am I here for a reason? Okay. Well, okay. I'm not quite certain what I'm doing here besides what I just did, but all right. If that's all they want me to do, that's fine for now. We'll, we'll head out. I still got to find some rice so I can make that rice scout. Like I was saying, you're going to need to step up in our organization. If this operation is going to survive, we'll need to pull a big one. A big score. I've been planning this job with my brother for a while. He doesn't want to do it now. I need you to step in and help out. So listen, here's the take. I need you to stock up on carrots. Yeah, that's right. You heard me. Carrots. I'm not talking about a few. I'm talking about a shitload of carrots. That's the thing we need for this job. And if it doesn't make sense to you, that's too bad. If you don't need to know everything. That's why they call it short shots. Okay. Well, I guess I'm... I need... A hundred freaking ca what? <laughs> I'm sorry, what? A hundred carrots? Excuse me? Stella, this is quite the vessel. At this point, it's essentially sailing village. It's a real community. Do you remember Donna? The flower girl with beautiful long red hair. You know, Donna. She went to the desert with some of her friends. And they all followed this man in a long robe and silky hair around. They called him Jimmy Jim, which always sounded odd to me. Was Jimmy a diminutive of James? Was James Jim his last name? I just couldn't let it roll off the tongue. You'd think a cult leader would be better at coming up with names. Donna kept telling me they were looking for some kind of a new water. That water in cities was too tainted full of city sweat and bad omens. Oh, that was needed to find a better, cleaner source of water in the desert. She kept wanting me to come with them, telling me that it was new water to heal everything, that their new community could would be beautiful. Everyone in harmony with each other, it was nature. Well, it didn't take long for everybody to be dehydrated. And the well they dug, oh, well, lasted a few weeks and everyone started fighting over the water. I guess I'm just saying that I didn't know you're busy. You've got things to tend to, people to see, places to be. I don't want to be a bother, but I'll just have a to be. 
I've been thinking about a way to repay you for that running around. I've, uh, got a pretty good idea, but I need your help for the final touch. I was talking to, uh, one of the people on the boat. Oh. Uh, I'm so bad with names. Well, new names. I can't seem to remember your passengers. Oh. They must be, uh, all the comings and goings. Well, uh, they were saying something. Sometimes the boat goes through a swarm of fireflies. Their bellies are full of glow seeds, or fire glow seeds. Well, look at that. You've already got some fire glow. None of that tr or no need for all that trouble then. Oh. Some beautiful, perfectly spicy fire glow. Oh, what the heck. I can't keep it a secret for much longer. Oh. Do you remember when we first moved into the building? I had uh, been there for years. So I sold the house a few months after David died. Oh. The kids were heartbroken at first. They never, they were never there. They just wanted their old rooms to stay perfectly intact, I suppose. Ah. Well, back to you. Your fridge broke on the first day, poor thing. Ah. I could tell you you were broke and couldn't afford takeout. Do you remember what happened? Yes, that's right. I made you soup. Not just any soup. My favorite soup in the whole wide world. Ah. It was Laska, Loxa. It was the first thing I ate when I moved to the big city alone. I had moved there to be closer to my sister. It was quite the trip. It took a few days. Well, when I got here, my neighbor Ariana from uh, 32B invited me to dinner. Neighbors were friendlier back then. She uh, served laksa. I'd never tried it before, but instantly fell in love. For a year straight, I must have invited myself to dinner at least once a week. Hopeful I didn't overstay my welcome. Her family was so nice. In any case, spicy food became the ultimate friendship test. I can stomach it. Then you can stomach me. And you passed with flying colors. I couldn't help with your fridge, but I could help keep you fed. As in my gift to you and Ariana's family recipe. I can't recreate it anymore. Well, that's not true. I just believe it that at my age, I've done enough cooking for her lifetime. It's time to let someone else take the reins. If you can cook some loxa, maybe we could share it. You just have to put fire glow and um, ah. fire glow and some delicious powder of grain. Sorry about that. I must have slipped my mind. You'll have to figure it out, I suppose. Uh, if I had loxa in front of me, I would remember. Wouldn't that be lovely? Oh, so I have to figure out how to cook loxa, I guess. So she definitely has some sort of memory issue. Or she's kind of losing it. Um, I don't think it's as serious as Alice was, because Alice was just, like, completely couldn't remember anything. And I think that was Alzheimer's. This could be, like, something similar, like dementia or something of that nature, but I'm not 100% certain. Oh, I don't have any rice, though. That is a problem. Hmm. Well, I'm going to have to... I have tomatoes, though. I could make some tomatoes. I'll do some tomatoes, and I'll keep one slot open. Nah, I won't. I'll make some... What else did I get? I'll just do two tomatoes and one... Wet. And then we'll have to find some rice somewhere. Because I'm going to need it. I'm definitely going to need it. And then apparently I need to just grow carrots like there's no tomorrow. Because <laughs> I need like a hundred freaking carrots. So I better just get carrots going. Maybe, you know what would be a good plan? Actually, I have, a, I, have, I have a plan for that. I do have a plan for that. Maybe it'll be... Nope. Just, okay. Um, let's plant these carrots in here. It feels weird just making a bunch of carrots, but... And then giving a hundred carrots away, that seems kind of weird, too. I feel like I'm giving a lot away when I do that, but oh well. Okay. So I got some grain. Thank you. Oh, wait! Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Can I stop this? I can Oh, oh, hold on. Okay, I'm going to remove, like, I'm going to remove the last two. Oh, that's perfect. I don't need the rice anymore. I've got them. Okay, okay, okay. 
What a save. What a save. All right. Beautiful. So what do I need right now? I could build one of these. Um, okay, I could do that. I might do that. Yeah, let's do that. Can I... Not sure what that does a little bit, but we'll put that, like, right here, I guess. Or, you know what would actually be good? No. We could do it right there. We'll do that right there. And that should be fine. Okay. And then, as far as improvements go, I know you need a clock. I need a bunch of gold. And I don't know where to get that. So that's a problem. What about your place? Because you're going to start asking for stuff. I could do this. So I might do that. Okay, we'll do those. And I just need zinc ore for that. Okay. Well, let's go check on the animals. Oh, I got some more silk. Do these ever turn to mulberries? I don't know... What happens there? I feel like they should at some point, but they haven't to this point, so very confusing. My sheepies are starving. Sorry, sheepies. I forgot to feed my sheepies. My bad. Give you some cherries. You'll like it. They're good now. Um, okay, so in the morning, we're going to go get Jackie... Uh, with my rice. That should be nice. Let me check on my chickens. I got some eggs. Yes. Okay, I'm almost out of grain, so we'll put some sunflowers in there. Blip, 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 blip. There we go. And uh, where's my cow? There's my cow. What's up, cow? Let me milk ya gonna milk them water so good okay um so i need zinc and aluminum ingots i'm gonna make those now because i probably have zinc ore so let's just get like five of those i know i'm almost out now and then it was aluminum well, I can't do that until after this, so let's do the zinc first, and I think... Oh, I need to add coal, I guess. All right, we'll do, like, 15 of them. We'll do, like, 20, because that'll last me a while, I assume. And then if I do this, I could probably get most of what's her, the What's-Her-Name's house done. Might even be able to get all of it done, which usually is a pretty big step. Okay, that should be enough. Okay, and then I think that was... That was my zinc, so let me do the aluminum. But I'm gonna have to get gold. I feel like gold is about to be super important. Now, I know where I could find some gold, because I remember seeing it on one of the towns in, like, uh, the industrial area. But that's really the only place I've seen it. I kind of assumed that a lot of the gold would actually be in this area. That's kind of what I thought. Okay, let's see what we can do now. Oh, I'm still short one zinc. All right. Let me do... Oh, I already did that. Did I... Oh, I already built that. Okay, so I could do... Why can't... Why can't I make it? 
the Lean That Streams is proud to support an ongoing donation drive right here on Twitch for the Lemur Conservation Foundation. Am if I you short? want to support the stream in an awesome way and Wait, can afford am it, I check short? it out. Wait. To learn more, check out the link in chat at thelemurreserve.org. Oh, I have no glimpse, that's why. Okay. Alrighty. Um, I didn't know I was so poor. That's a shame. I need glimpse. Okay. Good to know. Well, let's let's head somewhere. Interesting. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go to you. And then I'm going to do uh I'm going to go see what the the all the materials in this area what that gives you because I assume I'm assuming that materials are going to be super... I'm guessing gold is going to be the main thing out here. If that is true, then we're in really good shape and I can actually continue to make my stuff. Um, so that's what I'm kind of hoping is the case. But also, I need to uh, buy some things. So, Or I need to sell some things, which I don't have anything to sell. Oh, good. Okay. Well, that's, uh, that is not good. Huh. Maybe buying the bigger ship was not the good plan that I thought it was. Okay. Well, let's check on over here. How you doing, old lady? You're hungry. What? I still am not 100% certain what you like. Oh, you like spicy food. That's right. You like spicy. Okay. So, I think I'm going to hold off feeding you. Because I want to try and make that soup you were talking about. Oh, of course, we're here already. Hold on. Go down. There we go. Okay, so I got garlic seed and pine wood. That's new. I didn't see any. There's one. Morning, kid. Wait, I'm way off. Hold on. Okay, so usually this is where minerals are. Ooh. Electrum sheet. And I got rose gold. That's good. I did need that. Interesting. molding you need food okay hold on guys everybody needs food i get it i get it but i don't have anything to gives you at the moment so i'm gonna try and cook this thing i'm gonna do fire glim uh let's do like two of them and then they were saying it was like um a type of what was that oh um it was a type of flower so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna check this okay so it can't be it can only be corn flour or rice flour okay let me do this i have one rice wait no i'm not using rice i'm using rice flour so I'm going to do this. I'm going to remove one remove one of these. And we're going to start with rice flour. And we're going to see if that is it. Mickey wouldn't uh wouldn't get up with done up by anybody. He was untouchable. Nobody could get him. One night, he just got in his car. He probably had a few too many. He drove his car over um over the overpass straight into a lake. He didn't wake up. Winded up in a hospital bed for six months. Not moving. It still felt like him. Silent, but dangerous. You could see um, the rage in his face. He didn't want to be in that bed. At least for not that long. Oh. So is that what happened? Is that why, like, Mickey seems so, like, kind of, like, just there? 
That's interesting. Kid, I bet you're hungry. I would. I know you wanted to talk. Why do you have to be right in front of a door? <sighs> And that's why he has to be carried around everywhere, because he was in a coma. It sounds like he was in a coma. That's interesting. I'm starving here. I'm not being dramatic. You're being dramatic. <laughs> You're being dramatic, you dramatic fool, you. Uh -huh. Thank you, Skipper. This meal is nourishing. I love this burb. Hmm. This one's going to be sad. Uh -huh. I wonder... I haven't really talked to you much. I found something you might like, perhaps. Here's a gift for my collection. I hope you appreciate the values of a miniature diorama. I really just want to talk to you, though. I don't like this. All right. Fair enough. Um... Where am I right now? Oh, my food's done. Laksa. Okay, I was right. I was right. It was rice flour. Beautiful. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. Bam. First try. Oh. Um, you got all the spices right. It smells amazing. All right, let's me give it a try. My stomach is basically hot pepper at this point. I can handle it. Okay, let me give you some laksa. Oh, it's just the right kind of tongue burning. I mean, it's incredible. You haven't lost your way around a kitchen. Wow, I can feel my sinuses clearing. Thank you, sweet pea. I suppose I got carried away a bit there. Sorry, there isn't any left for you. Don't worry, I'll make it up to you. I know, I know. This was supposed to be a treat for you as well. Next time, well then, do you have a minute? Like I was saying, I haven't been, or I've been having this dream. Don't worry, I'm not a monster. I will start telling you my dreams. Well, maybe a little bit. So, in my dream, I was using the archive room of B2522 uh, when I was transported inside the images. And the first image was, let's see. Oh, I remember. When I was sightseeing in the city. Uh, we rented an apartment for the whole family. I was uh, so luxurious. We had a whole week planned out. Museums, parks, restaurants. Obviously, Henry got sick on the first day. I remember staying by his side knitting. The only thing he was able to do was draw. Poor thing. He was really obsessed with his cartoon back then. It probably is, uh, was, it was, it's probably just giant robots and men in tights. The apartment was somewhere in the old central district. I suppose did, I, it was supposed to be our home away from home. For a week at least. And the whole time I was eating a giant bag of sweet corn. That's dreams for you. They were always a bit foggy. However, hopefully, uh, if you find the acetate, it would jog my memory a bit. Thanks again, Sweet Pea. You're a lifesaver. Okay. So she definitely has memory issues. Um, and I think what we're going to do now is we're going to go get Jackie. Because uh, it is time to do that. I can, I can, I can bring Jackie aboard the ship. I'm also got carrots a brewing. I don't know if that's what growing really, not a brewing. That would be weird to brew carrots. Although I don't know. Could you make like? I bet you could if you got like fermented carrots. I bet you could make like a mean carrot beer or something like that. I don't know. I don't make these things, but you could do it. I'm sure. In any case, what time is it? Let's go. We also have uh, this new place we could stop by. Obscure Canopy. And then uh, whatever this is, Overbrook. We have to go back there. So let's do this. Let's go here, here, and off we go. No, not bus stop. Crap, hold on. I didn't mean to go there. I meant here and then here. That's what I meant. Slight course adjustment is all it really is. Um, 
And then I got rice. I'm not putting rice in there, I can tell you that. I'm gonna put some corn in there. Okay, so upgrades. What am I doing? Moon Solo, the Silent Orca, immense sized ship. I have no money, so I can't do that. Uh, but you want gold ingot, you want, oh man, you want everything. Pine planks, Electrum Sheep. I don't know what an Electrum Sheep is or what that does. I bet my, are my sheepies good? They're fine. I have enough wool to last for like 20 years, so I'm pretty okay there. We chickens. Thank you for the eggs. I've got, I'm going to have unlimited supply of eggs. Am I really out of seeds already? How often do they go through seeds? Because they are going through them quick. Oh, I guess it was not completely in full. That's fine. So she was saying, go find the acetate, which would be like a, okay, I guess we're here. Uh, obscure canopy discovered. Okay, so good. I don't know what that means or what I can do here, but um, let me give you an, uh, uh, some food. So she wants to go back to one of those towns because I'm guessing that's where we're going to find the acetate that she's speaking of. I think I know which town to go to, too. So that's good. Because uh, basically they're saying go to... I need carrots. That's true. I need that clock and I need rice to Jackie. I mean, we're already going to do that. Yep. Oh. We're moving. Fine. I didn't get there in time. It's okay. Okay. Here we are. We're at the old hospital. How far am I away from your thing? I Okay, so the only thing I need is more zinc, and I just need money, because I'm poor. Oh, okay. Let me just fall in the water there. All right, let's go get Jackie, though, because maybe that'll help me in some way. I wonder what, like, Jackie's, like, thing is that helps me get stuff. She's gonna have something, right? And that's gonna be a thing. Can I get anything from this thing again? No. Why is this place so... Here's a question I have. Why is this place so worn down? You see what... You know what I mean? Like... Hey. You managed to put the rice together for five bags of rice? Great. Uh, maybe they'll lay off my back for a minute now. Who am I kidding? They won't. Well, Stellars, you're, as usual, you're a lifesaver. I don't know how you do it. Well, better get back to it then. This slop ain't gonna distribute itself. Come back sometime, eh? I can sure use a break. Interesting. Hello, you. Would it be possible to, well, if it's not too much to ask, would it be possible to take a small, just a tiny, nothing really, would it be possible to, for me to take a small bite of you? What? Sure. Thank you very much. I definitely uh, say you have the taste of chicken with hints of uh, different spices. Maybe oregano? It was quite a good bite. Okay, then. I guess he just bit me. That is interesting. I'm not sure I feel about that, but we'll, that's fine. Oh, I can jump on the... I can... Oh, I didn't know that. Okay. Interessante. Ooh, glimpse. Rice pudding. I feel like I've already made that. 
I feel like I already, I definitely already made that. I don't know why that would be a thing I would need to do. Um, okay, so let me do this Glim bottle. That gave me some money. That's good. Do I have any more? No, no. Oh, overbook. What does this do? Hey, hey, you. Uh, are you hurt? Are you sick? Are you rich? Then come over to Overbrook, your one-stop shop for all your health needs. Featuring state-of-the-art, expert medical staff, and gourmet cuisine from our modern cafeteria. See you soon. Uh, something tells me that that is not true anymore. Hey, look, I made it up here. More glims! Hey, you. Listen, you. I'm in big trouble. I'm not even supposed to be here. They got me. They got me good. I'll get them good. I was sleeping in a park, minding my own business, doing what Mark does, which is uh, sleeping in parks. I already said that. Pay attention. So I'm out of this bag of, I'm out like a bag of clementines. Then out of the blue, I'm here. I'm not even sure where this is. I just know that Mark here, which is me, is not supposed to be here. Mark needs to be free. Free to sleep in parks. Feels like uh, the squirrels. So here's the plan. I need to make a rope. The rope can help me climb back down. Uh, I'm, I've got it. Uh, I've got a guy. Yeah, I know a guy. I know some guys. So this guy is standing by, waiting for Mark here to make his escape. If you bring me some linen, uh, I'll make some nice rope and I'll be out scot free. And you'll get, you know, satisfaction of helping Mark. Hurry back with linen. I can't eat another bowl of this gruel. Gruel. But wait one second. You've already got some. Yeah, hand over the limit. Yeah, sure, right on. Nice, nice, nice. Thank you. Uh, I'm going to escape and meet the guy, and it's going to be amazing. I can't thank you enough. Mark would say, later. But you never, you'll know, never see Mark again. <laughs> Was Mark a ghost? Did Mark ever exist? Well, he does, because I'm Mark. Prestige. Later. Okay. Now, now, where's my guy? I have no idea, sir. Oh, oh, oh! Ugh, that's fine. What does Jackie want now, though? Nothing. Huh. Oh. Yes, that was very chickeny. No, right? Sure. I know, that was a little weird, wasn't it? Just, well, I'm gonna bite you. Hi there, I'm Flo. This is Lau. We are looking for a cat. She's quite old, but she's great. You can't be that far. She's so fluffy, super fluffy. She sleeps a lot. Sometimes she sleeps on my back when I'm uh, reading. I'm not super comfortable for me, but she likes it. When you have a, have you ever seen a, if you, well, have you seen cat beside yours? Uh, I don't, maybe you have, that's amazing. Here, there's hope, Lau. Let's uh, keep looking. Thank you so much. I don't know if I actually did or not. I may have just lied to these people. Okay, so there's something up there. I might be able to make that jump. Oh, but there's like no way in there. Interesting. Oh, wait. Here's that. That looks like the ladder right here. Okay. Oh, hey, you. I got, You gotta help me out. My leg is all bent up. Look at it. Look at it. It hurts so bad. You gotta help me out and fast. I'm not going in there, though. I can't pay. I hate hospitals. Why did I come here, then? Uh, that's none of your business. Well, it is a weird decision on your part. As I was saying, I really hate hospitals. They smell like vinegar. Vinegar is for chips, not hospitals. Ow, my leg. Listen, I'm gonna need a few things. Listen up. I'm in so much pain. What? Household glue, sawdust, and pork. Why pork? The pork portion of that is interesting. Hi, how's it going? We're not open yet. Okay. It'll smell a certain kind of way. That's fair. Okay. So, there's not a whole lot I can do here yet. 
And I guess I just gotta wait for something. Salt and vinegar chips are one of my guilty pleasures. I do love salt and vinegar chips. I I would agree with you on that. 100%. So, what time... I can't navigate. Okay. Hmm. Petrichor is the smell of... Uh, smell of... Bef before rain. Yes, it is. Um... And the only reason I know this, because it was in a Doctor Who episode <laughs> uh, way back when. But I can't remember. I, I think it's something else, too. It might just be the smell of... I can't... I, mm, yeah. I'm back. Had to do quick work crap. No worries. Welcome back. I have tomatoes now. I still don't have rice, but I don't need it as much. So I guess we'll make some more corn and some more tomatoes. And some wheat. Because why not? Oh, I should probably water them, huh? Okay. So, I probably have some carrots I could pull. It's not nearly enough. Because I need, like... That gave me three. Well, see, the problem here is that's going to take a while. <laughs> that is going to take some time uh, to do. I have an idea, so I'm going to save some of these uh, carrots, and then I'm going to grow some onions. Because I don't have any onions. And I'll probably grow some of these mysterious ones. I think what I'm going to try is grow them on one of the turtles back for the carrots because I think when you grow stuff on one of the turtles backs it yields more than your standard grouping so it might be good for me to do that the other thing uh, I'm going to try and do here is I'm going to make some steak with some, I'm going to assume, tomatoes, and I'm going to see what that does. I don't know if it'll do anything. It could, it could possibly do absolutely nothing, but we'll never know until we try. I can't sleep for some reason. Is it already morning? What happened to my... There it is. Oh, it is morning. Okay. Alright, so, here's the plan. Petrichor sounds like a d dinosaur heavy metal band name. It, well, I could see that for sure. Um, did we not... Oh, I passed by it. I didn't see it. Okay. Um, okay, so here's what we can do. I don't know what's up here. There could be a lot of things up there. The only other thing I could think to do, though, is I want to stop by one of the turtles. Where am I right now? I'm right here. Okay. So, I think what we'll do is we will go to here. Uh, salt and vinegar chips always give me mouth sores. I could see that. They can have a pretty harsh, um, like, there is a harshness to them sometimes. So I could see that. Uh, just a bunch of petrodactyls rocking all night. That would be cool. That's something we need in our lives. Wee! Give me my eggs. Thank you, chickens. Wait, what? Hello? What do you got? What's this? I don't know. I don't know. What? What is this? Where are you going? What are you doing? If you want to talk to me, you got to stop. What are you? Okay. Uh, problem. Um, listen, that's a problem. Uh, Mickey. Listen, I can't. Oh no! What's wrong, Gecko? Gecko? Mickey, Gecko. I can't. Did a fly okay. buzz into your favorite jar of bug snacks? 
Don't Maybe. Worry. I'm Their sure planet there's plenty needs of them, apparently. My goodness, what is going on, on here? Stay strong. Mickey, My get down here. I can't. Mickey. <laughs> I know you want to talk, but the problem is I can't do that because you're way up there and... Okay. Mickey, I'll come find you later, buddy. Out. <laughs> Oh my god. So what we're going to do is there was another place where the mist actually is. And there was something down here at Crow's End. So I kind of want to see what's over here on the other side where there was a mist thing going. And I just want to see what it is. And remember, again, we're hoping to find... Uh, we're hoping to find some gold. Because I need gold. Good morning. Good morning, sir. Uh, so we're going to go over here and see what Crow's End is. Sounds lovely. Is what it sounds like. Now, oh yeah, I can also build, um, I can do this now. And we're just going to, oh, I gave up my linen. Okay. I need linen now. God damn it. You know, let me get this food out of here. Let's see what this makes real quick. It makes meat stew. Everything makes meat stew. There's pretty much just, if it's any vegetable, are you guys still way the frick up there? There they are. Okay, what is this? What were you doing? Oh, come on. The job wasn't for carrots. It was for peaches. It wasn't, um, who would stupid carrots? Like, who would use carrots for this job? That's so stupid. You got to fix this mistake quickly. Uh, just depends on peaches. Lots of them. Really? You can mod this, um, you can mod this on the Steam version. That would be cool if you could just add more characters. I don't know if you can. You might be able to. Uh, I don't have the Steam version. This is on the PlayStation, but um, maybe. Maybe you could. Request mask off. Yeah, I have Xbox. Okay, gotcha. A hundred peaches? A hundred peaches? You're insane is what you are. Wells Fartco? <laughs> what? What? I'm sorry. Oh, I need that. Open that. Do I have another one of those? No. Okay. To whom it may concern, on the behalf of Fart Bank and Farto Police, um, of which you are one of the prime benefactors, please accept... Uh, Oldman Sacks, right? I haven't heard of any modding capabilities for Spirit Fair, unfortunately. Yeah, it would be, I think for that kind of a game, this kind of game would be kind of tough, but that would be kind of cool if they did. Um, this is not really a letter from the bank. This is from Jackie. And I farted in the envelope, pranked. <laughs> yeah, true. Like a lemur's fluffy, striped tail. What? You know what they say, crispy lemur. Yeah. The truth hurts, just like stepping on a Lego brick barefoot. But hey, at least it's always entertaining, right? So true it is, my furry friend. True it is. Okay. I don't know what he was talking about there. Uh, Frank, I just want to tell you the vending machine has finally been fixed. Come check it out. Okay. It's a vending machine, Jackie. I'm not that impressed by it, but okay. Well, we are here. What could this be? Please be gold. It doesn't look like gold, but maybe it's gold. It, it kind of looks like zinc. It is iron. It was none of those things. So that's unfortunate. Um, okay. This is a bouncy thing, right? Yeah. Oh, oh, come on. I don't know if I can make it that far. Crap. Crap. This thing doesn't bounce me high enough. 
Oh, there it goes. Okay, cool. Okay, so I just need to get up here. Stay back. You can't stop me. I'm here on a mission. Cool kids join the conspiracy on I'm going to throw this cherry bomb so down this why hole. Why? Because I feel like it. My dad can't stop me. This is the great outdoors. His, he doesn't own this. Nature always wins. No. Whoa, wow. Wowie wee wow. Oh, shit. Wow. I just made that. Take that, Dad. I'm my own person. Okay. I accept you for who you are. Well, thanks for that, I guess. Okay, so there's somebody up there, but how the hell do I get to you? I don't think that's going to do it. Maybe it will. Hold on. Mm, no. What am I... Mi oh, there's a thing over here. Okay, hold on. Well, I don't know if that helped. Ooh, this is new. Could this be our first gold? Gold! Ha <laughs> ha We found gold. Yes, gold, gold, gold. Here we gold, gold, gold. I've got gold. Give me gold. Hold on. Thank you. Child. You look lost, young one. I can show you what I've been missing this whole time. Let me come aboard. My teaching starts now. The dog whisperer. <laughs> wow, okay. I wasn't expecting to get a new passenger just like that. Ooh, salad green. Green salad. Okay, that sounds lovely. Whoop, whoop. Where does this go? Oh, I guess there's another way to get there. Got it. Okay, then. Well, we got a new friend already. Another person. We're finding everybody now. A visitor. What are you doing here? Uh, this place is closed. Shut down. Abandoned. Nobody comes here. It's like a graveyard. Was my uh, This was my factory in Crow's End, Inc. You don't believe I could uh, own a factory? Well, I did. Uh, it was the biggest mistake of my life. I had employees. I had deals. I had shipping manifests. The whole nine yards. We had our old, uh, this whole company could have. Um, how'd I lose it, you ask? Well, it wasn't my fault. Those damn Theodores. They all came in all innocent. Look at us. We're Raccoon Inc. Then, when you're not looking, they take your territory. Distracted by this, they steal your employees. They crush your dreams. And, and, they smile at you while you're doing it. Oh, Theodore, you little shit. The animals. When your wife leaves you and your kids don't even look you in the eye... Well, maybe that... Never. I never... I say never own a factory. Well, you know... Business is tough. Business is difficult. Sometimes, you gotta be very careful about the people you trust in your business. I can't get in there. That's okay. But we got gold! We got our gold! Hell yeah. I got my first gold. I'm very excited about that. Going back to the ship to meet my new friend. What was that? I'm in the water now. What is that? Also, where am I? <laughs> Where's my ship? Oh. Uh, I'm lost. I'm 100% lost here. It's kind of the thing. Uh, we gotta figure out where to go here, but... 
I guess it's that thing that guy blew up. Okay. Well. I take it this is where I get back to my ship. There we go. Okay. Let's go. You look like a adorable doggo. And uh, I'm all for a good doggo friend on our ship. So that's something that is going to be nice to see. And then I guess we can go get Jackie, I guess, uh, as well. Basta. Look into my eyes. This is serious business. Oh. Is he like a greyhound? Oh my god, I love it. That is, he's like the most serious looking dog of all time. Your training starts today. I can see it in your eyes. You are feeling overwhelmed with this job. You need guidance, balance, strength, <laughs> new skills, someone to teach you. That someone is me. From this point, there will be no backsliding. There will be no physical contact either. I need your full devotion and your cooperation. I will steal your resolve and bolster your courage. But only no nonsense allowed if you do as I say. I never question my methods. Now listen up, student. You would be tested. You would be graded. You would cry. In the end, you would succeed. Right, enough of this. Let's see what you're made of. A real challenge awaits on your feet. Quickly. Wait a second. Your skills are lacking. You can't do the challenges just yet. You need to train yourself some more. You'll need to be able to remove around freely. To push yourself with vigor in any direction. You need the ability dash. I won't tell you this again. Okay, but where do I get dash? Because I don't know where that would be. You acquired the dash ability. All right. Well, I don't know where that is, so. Whatever you say. Um... Interesting. I mean, I guess it could be down here somewhere, but maybe it is in Shadow Forest. Who knows? Oh, it's too late. Okay. Well, you're just going to stop. I need food. Well, listen, I don't care. <laughs> Uh, do you like moo moose? Thank you for this meal. Hog, physical contact will not be necessary. Okay, that's fine. I don't. You seem very rigid. I don't know how I feel about you. Okay, so. I get the feeling this hundred peaches thing is probably never gonna happen, so I'm probably not gonna do that. Um. Because I'm guessing I just need to start getting two peaches. And then maybe they'll be like, no, you don't really need that. Uh, but then we need to get Jackie. Um, and then Beverly needs acetate. Okay. So I think for now, guys, I think this might be a good spot to call it. Because I think we've hit an impasse. So I'm going to head to the main screen here. And there we go. That was uh, more Spirit Fair. Uh, this has been a lot of fun. Uh, it was a pretty emotional day when we had to go back to back losing Ingrid and Stanley uh, just like that. That was very emotional. Um, at first, I didn't think I was going to. Um, I didn't think I was going to feel that much for Stanley because we didn't get to round him too much. But that one actually really hit hard. Uh, and Ingrid did, too. Um, but I felt like Giovanni's ending was better than hers overall, but I guess like it's 
all preference, right? Like it's all kind of really sad stuff. But uh, we're going to be back next week. Yeah, peace all. It was really good having you guys around. Thanks for joining me today. I appreciate it. Uh, we're going to, I don't, I know definitely we're going to do some played up uh, this next week on Wednesday and then we'll have some more streams, but I have to schedule them and figure out what we're going to do. I think we'll probably try to finish Poppy's playtime. Uh, but until next time, guys, I'm going to send you guys over to Diffuse Moose. Um, who is playing some Fortnite. So they look really super scary right now. So get ready to go and say hello and give them the old being the streams welcome. Uh, and until then, have a great night, guys. Enjoy. <laughs>